Good morning. Hi, everyone. Happy Monday. Happy Persona 5 day. I hope y'all are doing wonderful. I hope you all had a great weekend. Let me quick put my headphones on. Guys, I'm so excited to play today. Literally, this game is all that I've been thinking about. And it's actually like... It's really bad. I can't stop thinking about Persona. But it's fine. It's completely fine. I'm normal. It's a normal obsession. Um, okay. Let me say hi to everyone. Uh, Cosma, congrats on coming first and second. Holy cow, that's... That hasn't happened for a while. Um, Enwen, welcome in. Derek, hi. Eric, welcome in. Michelle, Arthur, hi. Jose, Gabe, Mello, Ellie, it's good to see you. Bees, hello. Drummy, Cosma, thanks for grabbing your seat. Tay, hello. Athar, welcome in. Uh, Ash, hi. Blue, Miss Kalini, Egg, Amber, Sammy, Elder, Damonize, Chris, hello. Thank you so much for grabbing your seats. Oh my gosh. How is everyone doing? How was your weekend? Let me see if I missed any messages here. I have... I think I have Mitchell's fur. On my face. Oh my gosh. It's fine. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that remix, the remix of Madurame's palace theme is literally so good. I'm obsessed with it. The bass goes hard. Uh, Crimson, hello. It's good to see you. Emmy, welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Hi, commonly. Happy God of War Monday. Yeah. Yeah. God of War Monday. That's, that's what today is. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Anyways. Benny, hello, welcome in. Amari, hi, it's good to see you. How are you? Perfect way to end your morning. Third shift worker, Tay. I'm happy you could be here. Also, I hope you had a good um, good day at work. Uh, and when you get the day off, so you can actually watch the whole stream. Let's freaking go. That's so nice that you have um, a Monday off. Also, hi, Owling Puff. It's good to see you. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Uh, you should add a Kratos dancing gif or gif. Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Honestly, I feel like I should. Do you think there are any out there? I feel like someone had to have made one. <laughs> also, hi, bees. Welcome in. Thanks for having your seat. Um, Eric, not looking forward to school starting again. Eric, when does your next semester start? Maybe in like, is it this week or is it in a few weeks? I remember whenever I would go back to school after um, like the holiday break, we would start in the last week of January and I feel like that was always so late and like I would have friends that would go back in like the second week so it was really weird it was so weird like having two more weeks than um everyone else Nilla Nilla thank you for the 24 months two whole years what a way to start an upcoming tough week Nilla I hope this week is okay. Oh my gosh, I'm wishing you the best of luck with whatever you're doing. Um, I don't know if it's work-related or something else, but thank you so, so much for the resub. I hope you're doing well. Um, Ray, Ray, hi, thanks for doing hi, I'm new. Let me know if it's a call if I call you, let me know if it's okay if I call you Ray, Ray, uh, but welcome in. Also, M, hello, good morning. Thanks for having your seat. Raiden, hello, welcome in, how are you? Um, AFL, hi. How are you, Persona 5 Royal today? Yes, yes, we are doing some Persona 5 Royal. I know I said I wanted to play some different games on stream. Last week I was literally like, we're gonna do God of War Mondays and then Persona 5 is gonna be for Wednesdays and Thursdays. I'm telling you right now, if I had to wait till Wednesday to play Persona 5, you would not be hearing from me. <laughs> You <laughs> literally would not be hearing from me. I don't think I could survive that long without playing Persona 5. Uh, yeah, yeah. These past two Persona 5 streams have been so fun. And I'm just like, my mind is consumed by it. So, um, also Geeky, hello, welcome in. Uh, Arthur, you're off work today too. Let's go. Oh my gosh. God of War fans got it wrong today. <laughs> yeah. I'm sorry. Also, hi, Sahil. Welcome in. Roche, welcome in. How are you? How was your weekend? I hit the point of the game where you can't stop playing. Honestly, though, like, I'm worried that that's going to be the rest of the game now. Like, I don't know. How many more hours do I have? Maybe like 35 to 40 more hours. I feel like... 
I don't know, I'm just not gonna wanna stop playing. And to be so honest, I actually considered like scheduling a really long stream, like a, a 12 hour stream. <laughs> Just so I can play this game for hours on end with all of you. Um, Chris, it was great. Hung out with some gamers and lost my sanity splatting. Chris, it sounds like we had the same weekend, actually. <laughs> I don't know what we were talking about with God of War. I'm here for some Akechi. We're here for some Akechers today, okay? Okay, also Nina, hello, welcome in. How are you? Uh, hi, Skulder. After finishing this game, it's become my whole personality. <laughs> Judge me here. I feel like that's what's happening. It's already happening. And like, y'all, yesterday, I woke up and I was on Discord for like three hours just spiraling with Freezy and my friend Haley about this game. It was so, it was so bad. We were literally just talking about it for, for three hours straight. Um, Yang, hello, welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Welcome in. Uh, Kirstie, hi, how are you? Gulicious, welcome in. Um, I've been having a bad couple days, but Persona 5 stream will help. Um, I hope this week is like a nice refresh for you. Um, I'm sorry to hear you've been having a bad couple days. But I'm sending you like lots of good vibes. Uh, also, is it Akuzo? Hi, thank you so much. I hope you're doing well. Uh, Harold, hello, happy Monday to you. Nil, it's work related. Okay, I gotcha. Also, Nilla, the two year subscriber badge. I think you're one of the first people who has that. Because I think everyone else who has a two-year badge has the Founder's badge. So Nilla, congratulations! <laughs> it looks so good! I love it. <laughs> um, hi Abaddon, welcome in. I'm doing good today, how are you? How many hours in I am? Am I right now? Uh, I think I'm like 70 hours in? Maybe like 68 or 69 hours? Um, also subtext, hi! How are you? Can't wait to watch or can't watch to avoid spoilers. Afraid of how addicted you are playing this week in fear. <laughs> the addiction's getting too strong. <laughs> Subtext, it's it's really intense right now. The addiction is, <laughs> I'll just say that. Also, Lucas, hello, welcome in. Thanks for the follow. Um What's 40 more hours of just persona? Yeah, it's completely fine. Yeah. 24 hour stream, maybe it'll happen. Uh, you get like 15 hours if you unlock royal content. Okay, that's what we're planning on doing. I do have a like guide actually that tells me that I need to get, I think Maruki, Akechi's and Kasumi's rank to a certain number um, to unlock the royal content. So I have been like trying to follow that. Uh, long streamer probably good when you're getting ready to finish. Oh, base game? Okay. Also, hi, Skywalker Senpai. Yes, yeah, Nina also sent me the cutest Akechi and the Kira art. It was so cute. I like, I yelled. <laughs> I yelled. Also, hi, Haley, welcome in. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, Yang. Um, this week will hopefully get better by Wednesday. Okay, okay. Sounds good, um. Uh, I'm sure if you like Persona 5 so far, you're gonna love Persona 4 and Persona 3 for sure as well. Yeah, Ben, and I'm really excited to start Persona 4 Golden after this. I think that's the one that we're gonna play after this one. Um, so after Persona 5 Royal is done, we can play some Persona 4 Golden. I'm really sad. I'm really sad thinking about this game being over, but it's okay. <laughs> also, hi, Hannah, welcome in. Solar, hi. How you doing? Did you have a good weekend? I had a pretty good weekend. I feel like it was pretty productive. Um, there was a Splatfest this weekend on Splatoon, and surprisingly, I did not spend all weekend playing it. I spent a lot of yesterday playing, um, but I was able to get a lot of chores done and run some errands, so yeah, that was good. Um, Crimson, your first playthrough took you 135 hours. I will be so real with y'all. I was actually thinking this weekend, I was like, 
I kind of want to go to the mementos so I can just spend some more time with these characters. I'm that's that's how into this game I am now. I'm I'm actually wanting to go to the mementos. But also part of that is out of fear because I feel like I was underleveled <laughs> when I went to the fifth palace and I'm like, okay, we gotta we gotta level up for these next um, bosses that we'll have to do. Uh, Blue, hello, welcome in. Uh, H. Saki, hi. Thanks for grabbing your seat. <gasps> He's so. You wanna come here? You wanna come sit? No. You wanna say hi, me so? He said, I'm just gonna stand here. I'm gonna stand in front of your monitor so you can't see anything. Excuse me. <laughs> Come here. <gasps> Yay! Yay! Do you wanna say hi? He was being so silly this morning. You're so cute. Okay, I'll put you down. Um... Toffee, hi. Also, Josh, welcome in. How are you guys doing? Also, hi, John. Um, Owling, you've never played Persona for yourself. It'll be fun experiencing it with you. Yes, I'm very, very excited. I feel like um, there are quite a few of you here ha that have played Persona 4. Uh, but also, I feel like it's similar to Persona 5, where there's still a lot of you who also have not played it. Um, Edson, hello, welcome in, how are you? Post-persona depression is real, no, literally, I feel like I'm already feeling it. Uh, Lucas, hello, oh, from Argentina, welcome in, I hope you're doing wonderful today. So I'm making my way through your 10 playthrough. Oh, Final Fantasy 10 playthrough, watching your fight against Seymour. That was the worst, okay, Blue, that was horrible. <laughs> I hope you're enjoying the playthrough, though. Um, I also did another really hard boss this past week in Persona, actually. And, okay, Seymour and the Okumura Palace boss. I think those are the two worst bosses that I've ever done in video games. Um, sped run your first playthrough, didn't even get the true ending. You still somehow racked up 110 hours. That is wild. I love it though. Isn't it crazy how like we can have this many hours in a game and still we still want more? <laughs> like it's crazy. Um Can I try replay Persona 5 Royal again after Persona 3 and 4 come out? <gasps> so you play all of them together. I love that. I feel like I'm also gonna replay this game. And maybe like date different people and stuff. Um because I was actually thinking about getting it on my Switch and like starting another playthrough on there. Just on my own time. Um, Alan used to dislike mementos, now it's your favorite place. Yeah, for money grinding and persona fusing, yeah. I feel like I need to do more persona fusing. Um, because I was kind of, I feel like I was kind of neglecting it. But then last week when we were doing Okumura's Palace and stuff, I was like, wait. Fusing these personas is actually really fun. <laughs> so. Also, hi, Hefeldian. I know Kazutora Sips, literally. Don't talk to me about him. I was shocked. I was shocked at that. Um, let's see. About the Persona 5 manga, Toffee. Did you start reading it? I love that. Also, hi, Lavia. Welcome in. Rosh, you haven't played Persona 4 purely because you don't like gaming on your laptop? Wait. That's right, because... Wait, Rosh, is it only on PlayStation and Steam right now? Persona 4 is your second favorite game right behind Persona 5 Royal. I'm excited. I can't wait. Emmy of uh, Persona 4 Golden Downloaded. I haven't started yet. You want to wait till you're in... Yeah, the right headspace. Stardew Valley has been your girly past couple of days. Um, are you like, uh, gonna try to 100% start or anything? Or are you just playing it for funsies? Stream title, very catchy simp, hi, Yuya. 
<laughs> yeah, do you like the do you like the stream title today? <laughs> also, hi Michelle, it's good to see you. Um, you can start new game plus with maxed social stats. They let you do that. Holy cow. Also, Kristen, hello. Um, and heroes, hi. And you realize they make content specific. Did they actually? Wait, did they actually? I didn't know that. Also, Jose, welcome in. Thanks for the mod love. I think I already said hi to you, Jose. I'm sorry. There we go. Um, begging you for a... Okay, do you pronounce it Dangarampa? Dangarampa. Going through them your first time and you're obsessed. How many of those games are there? Because I feel like there are so many. Um... At the end of the month, Persona 4 Gold comes to everything. Right now, it's Steam and Vita. What the heck is Vita? Also, hi, happy, sad. Uh, kind of unfortunate for you that you're streaming at this time. Oh, it's midnight in the Philippines. Get some good sleep if you're going to bed soon. Um, <clears throat> hi for the new Fire Emblem. Coming out soon. That's right, Raiden. That comes out... Is it the 13th or the 14th? Or a different date. <laughs> uh, hi, Mingo. Welcome in. Thanks for the follow. Kristen, good morning. I am so excited for more Persona today, too. Oh, oh, PlayStation Vita. Sony's failed successor to the PS Portable. Oh, okay. I see. Um, also, Yuya, yeah, thanks for the mod love. Yo, we literally shout out to the mods here. As always. Comes out on the 13th. Okay, so new Fire Emblem on the 13th. You are still waiting for Persona 3 Portable on PC. It's That's coming soon too, isn't it? I forgot what date. Isn't it like the 17th of January? Um... Oh, January 19th. Yeah, okay. January 19th is when Persona 4 Golden will be coming out on all platforms and Persona 3 Portable. That's exciting. Um, Christmas, hello. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Thank you. I am doing well. How are you? Do you plan to play the Nier games? I actually would love to play the Nier games. Um, I'm not watching the anime because I think I do want to play the game first. Hannah, you watched the the first episode of Nier? How was it? Miso, you're so cute. Look at him. Do you want to say hi again? You did not like that. I'm so sorry. <laughs> also, hi, Colin. Welcome in. Thanks for the follow. Um, yes, Geeky. Go get some food. Let us know what you're going to make. Thanks for lurking. Also, uh, oh yeah, Shock's here. Hello. You joined the stream. Unfortunately, I'm still laughing about when Kristen asked if someone pissed in the top, in the top. Yo, wait, what? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Also, Bon, hi, welcome in, thanks for the follow. Um, and Claire, hello. I'm free on Monday to hang out a lot of please hang out with me on Monday when I'm free. Claire, how are you? Also, Sarah, hello, thanks for grabbing your seat. Guess where I left off in Persona last night? Haley, how far are you? I saw you were playing more, and I'm like, I want that to be me. Um,. Making some egg burritos, that sounds so good. Both Nier stories are perfectly crafted for video games, to be honest. Okay. So I'll play Nier. I'll play Nier first, and then I'll watch the anime. Um. Yeah, Sarah, me so first thing in stream. And now he's gone, unfortunately. 1117. <laughs> Haley, you're so far. I know the fact that you have to wait are 
strongest soldier. It was so hard waiting to play this game, y'all. I was like, I... It was the worst. Like, I've never felt this way about a game before. Um... Okay, also, yesterday, I mentioned this at the beginning of the stream, but, like, Haley, Freeze, and I were basically spiraling about this game on Discord for, like, three hours yesterday morning, and we made a list of our favorite characters, and I kind of want to share mine. I, I kind of want to share my list so far. Um, so we might do that before stream. And also, uh... What else? Oh yeah, I wanted to remind all of you that in the Discord, there is a Persona 5 Royal Spoilers chat. Um, so if you want to talk about my playthrough and like the game, including spoilers, you can chat in that channel. I have it muted and I'm not looking at it at all, so um, yeah. I don't know if people are using that, <laughs> but yeah. Um... Hi Tiz, welcome in. How much do you know about this game besides your streams? Literally nothing. I feel so lucky that I haven't really gotten spoiled yet. I kind of spoiled myself by re-watching the beginning part of it, like the first section where you're going through that casino thing, because I saw a certain character that joins our party. <laughs> and I'm just like, I'm so excited for whenever that happens. Um, <laughs> but, but yeah, that's that's basically all I know. Uh, it's so much fun watching you play the game for the first time, kitty cat. It's literally the best. It's the best. Uh, Jay, hello, welcome in. And Aluna, thanks for grabbing your seat. You didn't? Okay, listen, I didn't think it was gonna be a spoiler of any sorts, but then I was like, I was watching I was rewatching my VOD, okay? And then I was also watching my friend Katie play through it. And I was like, is that who I think it is? <laughs> also, Raiden, thanks for the mod love. Yeah, the mod's been doing freaking amazing at um, making sure that there are no spoilers in the chat and like same with backseating and stuff. So huge, huge shout out to them for being literally the best people ever. Um... <laughs> a certain character, yeah. A certain character, Morgana. That's exactly who I'm talking about. <laughs> also, hi, Rocker. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Um, and Kitty Cat, thank you for the mod love. One of the best things about playing Persona 5 again after you've played is noticing stuff early on that you uh, wouldn't have when you started it, yeah. I know, I feel like, um, this game is like that, and also Final Fantasy VII, like Final Fantasy VII Remake. I still haven't replayed Remake, but, um, I've, like, rewatched some scenes, and I'm like, wow. Watching that again after playing through the whole game? Wild. Zenin, hello! Thank you for the two months! What do you think of Tokyo Avengers Season 2? I am so excited for more. Also, my mind is just thinking about Kazutora. So that's- those are my thoughts. <laughs> Who do you ship Joker with? Akechi. Who else? There's literally no one else you can ship him with. Um... Have you watched any more Bochi? I haven't. I have only watched episode one still. I did watch more Dress Up Darling. I watched more Dress Up Darling this past weekend. And I love it. Except there's a really weird scene in episode six. I did not like that. Um, but everything else, wonderful. Um, <clears throat> episodes four to five of Joseph Darling is coded. It's so good. Episode four got me emotional. Um, who else, preferably everyone else? <laughs> Catchy hater in me is coming out. Roche. A lot of us are catchy lovers here. Just gonna say that. Actually, I don't know. Have things changed? Should we do another poll? If we're a catchy lovers or catchy haters? Because last time we did this poll, it was like 50 50. I'm gonna make another one. 
how we feel about a catcher's catchers <laughs> I had to put a heart at the end of each of these <laughs> um a catchy defender's holding strong yes yes a catchy needs a haircut no I love his hair okay okay Mad that we can't romance any of the persona boys they're all so charming yeah do you think they'll change that in persona 6 I don't know. I don't know. Is the fever literally? I'm just waiting. I am patiently waiting for that moment. Also, it's okay I saw that because I did spoil myself and I saw that he was in our party from the beginning of the, um, when I rewatched the beginning of the game. <laughs> so. Spooky. Spooky, thank you for the 100 bits. I appreciate that. It's like, okay, it's more than 50-50 now. We have 58% of you who love a catchers and 42% hate. Even as the catchy fans, we can agree that hair greasy. <laughs> There's no way it gets that messy naturally. This, he doesn't shower. Okay, listen, here is, here are my thoughts. A catchy, he has no one. He literally has no one, okay? He's so focused on work and being this detective prince. I'm like, my boy, you need friends. I don't think he thinks about that though. I think he is very lonely. Th Maybe I'm just making a very like emotional backstory for him, but I feel like, <laughs> I was thinking about this all weekend. I'm like, I feel like this boy got groomed by the adults in his life because one where the hell where the hell did the police find him and everything because he doesn't have he doesn't have parents right so how the hell did he get into this detective business did the police find him and they were like you should you should join us i don't know um and yeah, I just, I feel like he has no one. And that's maybe why he doesn't shower. <laughs> Cause he's just so focused on his work and being lonely. It makes me sad. Um, see, I think he showers. I think he showers. I don't know why people are saying he doesn't shower. I feel like he is a very clean boy. He wears gloves. Why the fuck does he wear gloves indoors? Like, I, I don't think he likes germs. <laughs> and now I feel like I'm spiraling. Anyways. <sighs> Xana, hello. Welcome in. Evie, hi. And Chris, hello. I think he showers. <laughs> the hair seems deliberate. That's what I think, too. He can't have those fangirls and not shower. Exactly, that's what I'm thinking. Maybe he's just obsessed with being clean. That's what I think too. Do you think the gloves he gets are sweaty? Do you think he changes his gloves every day? Do you think he has new gloves for like, every day? <laughs> I think his, um... Celebrity status forces him to stay clean and pretty. That's what I think too. Like, you cannot look like that and not be clean and smell good and have great hair. Gats, hello. Yeah, we are talking about catchy. We are. He's clean from the filth. Yeah, Pam's are exactly. I don't know why that was automated. Um, and Gats, thank you for grabbing your seat. Also, I missed the poll results. Why do I always do that? Let me bring them up again. 
Wow. Okay, so I feel like this kind of changed from last poll that we did, but we did a poll. How do we feel about the catchers? 57% of you said you love him. 43% said you hate him. Um, what's your favorite character list? Oh yeah, my favorite, my favorite characters. Okay. So, yeah. Let me bring it up. <laughs> and here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna show you the bottom, the bottom five, I think. And then I want y'all to guess going up, okay? Okay. Here we go. Move this over a bit. So we have 25 people on here. Um, I actually had 26, but the last one's literally like the the stinky politician, the bald one. And I feel like he doesn't even deserve to be on here yet, so. Me, hello, welcome in. It's going great, how are you? Thanks for having your seat. <laughs> Oi is last, yes. Um, Yoshida, Yoshida's at 24 because I literally have not talked to him. I've talked to him like once. I've talked to him once in my life. So. <laughs> Catchy's briefcase is filled with gloves. That's so funny. Also, John, hello. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Okay. But yeah. So we have Oya, Yoshida, Jose, Chihaya, Lala, and Igor in the top bottom the bottom five. Yeah. No, the bottom six. Um commonly Yoshida became the first confidant you max. No regrets to love him. Okay. Same with Freezy. Freezy told me the same thing that that's that he was the first confidant that she maxed out. I really really want to try to um, rank up with all my confidants today, like even Oya and Kawakami, because I've really not been talking to them. Um, so we're definitely going to focus on that today. Anyways, Kawakami and Haru are my bottom two. <laughs> Haley, I feel like the Haru stands are going to come for you. <laughs> anyway. Okay. Okay. Um. Can we guess who's number 19? Number 19 is. High inverted realm. The twins? You are so right. <laughs> You're so right. I. I think I, I like them more than Igor. Because I think they're funny. Um, they get mad at us a lot. So yeah. Who's Lala again? Lala is Oya's friend at the bar. Um, rolled back 10 hours of progress for previous save for Takemi. No way. Also, hi, Blue Coral Lipstick. Again, I just, I haven't talked to Yoshida a lot. I've talked to him once. All right. I don't even remember who my number 18 was. Maybe I should actually pull up this full image for myself. Okay. Okay. Number 18. Hi, Fox Sorrow. Thanks for the hydrate. I'll make sure you drink some water. Oh, yeah. 25 is deserved, though. I feel like there are so many Oya haters. Did the two fashion bros make a list? No, they didn't. <laughs> they did not. I feel like we only really have the confidants on here. Okay. Number 18. Bay, thank you so much for the follow. Also, hi, Katie. Good morning. Roshi, think Gun Daddy's at 18? If Howard's anything less than top 15, I'll riot. We'll have to see. We will have to see. Number 18 is... Miss Kawakami. I don't hate her. But also, she's kind of weird. <laughs> like, she... 
why why was she making sure that she looked good in her swimsuit while she was on vacation or not even on vacation while she was taking care of these high school students strange very strange <laughs> Also, Saint felt welcome in Instant Pinata. Um, John, thanks for grabbing your seat. I'm sorry I missed those earlier. Um, she's higher than you'd expect. Okay. Yeah, Katie, you agree? Needs to go to jail? Yeah. I heard you can romance her. And I'm like, I'm really curious as to how that would work. <laughs> Why is she always in her high school student's room? Um, you like Kawakami purely because of her confidant skills? Yeah, I I see someone said that her like rank 10 ability is really nice. Her character would be good if the whole teacher romance wasn't a thing. Yeah. Okay. Next up is number 17. Who do we think is gonna be? Who comes who comes after Kawakami? She was enjoying her vacation. A catchy Katie. Katie, you know me. <laughs> 17 EY Mishima. I think they should have made the characters college age, would have made the romances a bit better. I agree, Pamsra. I think that would be really nice. Also, hi Neelix, welcome in. Um, Kawakami was very rude in the beginning of the game. Yeah, Melo, she was. She was she was very apathetic, I feel like. Ultric, you say Sai. Ultric? You're correct. You've won. It's Sai. Um, I would have had her higher prior to when we saw her with Makoto. She talks to Makoto in such a rude way and i'm like why are you like this i feel like maybe she's just stressed with work and stuff but like you don't gotta be so rude to my girly um ey needs to be top 10 his voice actor needs to not go that hard he's so good <laughs> so so good want to see what your ranks will be by the end of the game yeah yeah i think that'd be really fun and we can compare raiden you like how caught me over Sai? Wow. See, I can't agree with that. I I feel like I do love Sai. But still. Um <laughs> Sai cracks me up every time we make a new confidant. I know she's like, what are you telling me? What are you telling me? Who did you work with? Okay, um, next up, number 16. I feel like some of y'all are gonna be mad at me about this. Number 16 is... Roshi think Morgana? Shima, Hifumi? Haru? Kasumi? Kasumi. I feel like y'all are gonna be mad about this. <laughs> the thing is, again, I feel like I barely talk to Kasumi. So... Kind of a mid character so far, yeah. Yeah. I don't know. They can only cost me more when skin to the yeah royal extra content yeah like I don't know. Haley, you agree with me? Not mad about that. Okay. Can't wait to see your list after you finish the game. <laughs> okay. Yeah, Kasumi is number sixteen. Again, we've had like I don't know maybe five conversations with her. So. All right. Next up, number fifteen. Number fifteen, everyone. Thoughts? Gotta be Mishima now? 
Mishima over Kasumi is criminal? As a horror defender, I can respect this. <laughs> okay. Also, Chris, thanks for lurking. I appreciate it. Um, the fortune teller, Kami, we already have the fortune teller in here at number 22. I think that's her name, Jihaya. Maybe Alana's had a change of heart. <laughs> and values Discord mods like Mishima more. Stop. Okay. Okay. Number 15 is our girly Haru. I will be so honest. I will be so honest. Um, if I made this list before I beat Okumura, I definitely would have put her lower. But after we beat uh, Okumura, I was like, you know what? You're kind of a baddie for doing this to your dad. So, um, Mishima's popular. I feel like so many people hate Mishima. Yeah, and I, I just, I just met her too. Probably the worst of the high school news <laughs> for sure. Um, also, hi Yami, thanks for grabbing your CD. Welcome in. Milady is such a goofy line. It's so funny, and I feel like her voice cracks when she says it. You want to put Haru lower? Her Haru lower. Her introduction was overshadowed by Morgana's story. That's what I think. Yeah, she was introduced in a weird way. Kind of understandable. Yeah. Came too late for any love to be spared, right? She was introduced like halfway into the game. Love when Haru yells for Sona tries to be tough, but her voice doesn't allow it. <laughs> Michelle, your meeting was only supposed to be 30 minutes long. End up being an hour and a half. Michelle, I would lose it. I would absolutely lose it. Um. Your relationship with Akechi was hate turns into love. Yami, that was me too. I was like, I remember when we first met Akechi, I was like, I don't know how I feel about you. Like, do I like you or do I hate you? And I was like, wait, I kind of love you. And now it's just like full blown love and adoration for Akechi. Anyways. Um, okay. Yeah, Haru's number 15. Number 14. Any guesses? So know what she says, tut tut milady. I know I don't know either. I don't know heroes. Bro, she think Hifumi? Mishima? Mishima, don't say that about Mishima. What if Akechi has a carpeted bathroom just like me? Just like me for real. Spot feels right for Morgana. Okay, number 14 is EY. Um, EY, beautiful man. Beautiful man, beautiful voice. But also, I haven't really talked to him a lot. Uh, hi, Trap, and welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Not my boyfriend being <laughs> so low. It's, again, like, I, yeah, I'm very early in his confidant story. Um, I think I'm only, like, rank one or rank two, so. Your hoodie samples come on Wednesday. That's so exciting. I saw the pictures in Discord. They look so good. They look so, so good. I store some kick-ass music so he gets bonus points. That's so true. One of the best songs in the game, to be so honest. All right, next up, number 13. Number 13, any guesses? Yeah, Owling, that's literally what I was going- I was going with that. <laughs> His voice looks alone. <laughs> Roshi, think Futaba. Morgana. Dondos, hello, welcome in. So this past weekend, I made a list of my favorite characters. And I'm showing y'all my list. I hope you're doing well, Don. And thanks for grabbing your seat. Hifumi? Raiden, you're gonna keep saying it till <laughs> she was on there. It's his time to shine. He is number 13. My boy Mishima. Okay. 
Bees, not the Mitchima. I can't with that. Um, I don't know what to say about Mishima. He is so annoying sometimes, right? Like, he cannot stop talking about the fan site and everything. I think he's very sweet though, and I feel bad for him. I feel bad for him sometimes because he literally gets invited nowhere. <laughs> the intentions are there for her, yeah. Yeah. If he was higher than Hifumi, I think I'd have to leave. Mm -mm. I think it's because he's kind of cringe, but it's uh, cute in a way, right? I think you adore Mishima. Your favorite uh, persona so far are from his Arcana too. Leonard on the loud side. <laughs> when he has to be your roommate. And when you think he gives off but actually energy, I don't get that from him at all. Like, I don't get that from him. Because I feel like he's too afraid to like counter your opinions, if that makes sense. Um, unless he's talking about the fan site. He was bullied him too nice, so I feel bad. Yeah, when I have to be mean to him, I feel bad so... I I feel the same way. Um, also, Ron, hello, it's good to see you. Adi, hello, thanks for grabbing your seat. Um, Mishima just needs to grow up a little and cringe <laughs> his past self. Or, or he can embrace it, okay? He can just keep doing whatever. He can embrace the cringe. It's fine. It's just someone that needs a good friend. Melo, I agree with that. Mm -hmm. He just talks lots only about one thing, so it gets a little repetitive. Just like me. <laughs> <laughs> We're gonna revisit this list later on? Yeah, yeah, we will don those. Maybe like at the end of the game or like again before we almost finish the game. Um, Futaba's the better nerd. I do love Futaba. I love Futaba a lot. Okay. Uh, hi, Celine, dear. Welcome in. Thanks for the follow. And Seasons, hello. I'm doing great. How are you? Alright, number 12. Any guesses for number 12? Morgana, Maruki. I feel like no one's gonna guess this one. The reason I hate Morgan or reason I hate Mishima is that I see a lot of your younger self in him. You look back on how unfathomably cringe he used to be. And that's why I hate him. Uh Takemi on Dad Jiro. Hi Jack, welcome in. It's Joker. I don't know if I should have included him in here. But I'm just like... <laughs> I don't know! I don't know! Like, I think he's so cool. I love him. I love him. Like, don't get me wrong. I literally love him. But also... It's... I, I have no words. I don't know what to say. Joke would be higher if he said we are more than three words. If he said more than three words. That's what I think too, Hanno. We are him. Yeah. Like. I don't know. Do you realize that Sojiro's entire tone towards Joker changes after he... Oh, helped Futaba. Yeah, doesn't it? Twelso? You adore uh, Joker in the anime? Honestly, I feel like that will probably happen with me too. He's just a silent protagonist for me right now. When anime gave him a voice and he said more than three words, it was so jarring, I bet. Um, never really understood people who put Joker in top five. So you agree for a thank you. Thank you. Joker has more personality than many JRPG protags, but he's still not as developed as the rest of the cast. Yeah, yeah, Dunham's. I think that's it. Like, I don't think he's as developed as all at all versus the rest of the cast. 
How I feel towards Joker in the anime is how Alana <laughs> feels about a catchy right now. <laughs> I'm biased by headcanon my Joker as a giant dork because of all the funny dialogue options you can pick with him. Yeah, he is so funny. Like, when was it the time that we were talking to a catchy with like the rest of the group? And then he's just like, Ryuji's a phantom thief. That was hilarious. Joker is a joker. So true. Okay. Next up. Also, yeah. Notice notice I put question marks next to him. Because I was like, I don't really know where to put you. Alright. Next up. Number 11. Maybe you've had more voice acting. Yeah. I agree, Pamzer. Number one is Cloud Strife. Deal with it. All right, y'all think we're gonna. You need to have a full picture of Akira before you can appreciate him. A lot of introspection and character study fix of him is what deepened your love for him. I'm so excited to finish this game so I can like look at all the fan art and read and watch every video about Persona 5 that I can. Futaba, Sojiro, Takemi on... Number 11, M. Yes. It is our man, Maruki. Maruki's very beautiful. He is so, so kind. Um, yeah. The snack doctor. Are you still suspicious of Maruki or nah? I was thinking about this a lot over the weekend too. Um... I don't know. My suspicions have kind of lowered. And I just feel like he's very, very nice and kind. And I should not be like being suspicious of his kindness. You know? <laughs> it's the sandals. <laughs> it's the sandals. That's why I'm suspicious of him. Um the first video we watch. After finishing the game, is is your skinny gang or your beard? Is that an actual video? I love you, Skate too. He salt bays. That's right. He has a little salt thing. It's so funny. It's fair to be suspicious. You're playing adults are bad. Literally, literally, Hanno. Okay, next up is number ten. We're in the top ten now, y'all. Top 10. Any guesses? Let's see if I can move this over just a bit. I don't know where to put this. Morgana on. Takemi. Ifumi or Takemi. You'll keep guessing Sojiro and eventually <laughs> be right. It's so funny how y'all have been guessing Morgana since, like, number 20. <laughs> Makoto? Number 10 is Takemi. I feel like that's a good spot for her. Takemi, love her. Still waiting for uh, Mishima's ranking to flip. Have him dropped to 31. Also, you are hello. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Uh, are your top three guesses are Akechi, Yusuke, and Ryuji? Interesting. Also, you are. Thank you so much for lurking. I appreciate it. Makes sense with how far into her confidant you are. Dr. Dami top 10 is respectable. Yeah. The two doctors are right next to each other. I love them. They are good adults. I'll say that. All right, number nine. Number nine, everyone. Hi, Laurent. Is this the 12 hour? We'll see. <laughs> we'll see where the, the, the day takes us. I don't think it's gonna be 12 hours though. No. Um, Futaba. Ifumi. Morgana on. M, M, you know me. You got it again. It's 
Sojiro, our bestie. This is Sojiro. Um, Sojiro is the top of all the adults. Because everyone else is, um, yeah, everyone else is in our group in high school. So, <clears throat> our collective dad, yeah, our coffee dad. Coffee dad made it to top 10, yes. If he rated his coffee and curry separately, it would be number one, so true. <laughs> also, hi, Jimmy and JD, welcome in. And Smoke. I'm showing y'all my, um, my list of favorite characters right now. Also, Turing, hello, thanks for grabbing your seat. Yeah, so Jiro's number nine. I love seeing I love seeing his character change from like when we first met him to uh to kind of like staying with him more and then when we meet Futaba he like really opens up and I loved seeing him get emotional over Futaba. It was amazing. Um all right, number 8. Number 8 everyone. Now the rest of the the rest of the characters on here are our besties. Becky's not listed yet, though. <laughs> the SIU director? No. <laughs> I don't have him on here. I also don't have Shiho on here. Um. Oh, Kamashi is not on here either. Kitty cat. Yes, it's Hifumi. I love my girl Hifumi! Okay, she's so sweet. I love how into Shogi she gets. Um, and we went on that date with her. Okay, we went on that date at the beach in Hawaii. And I'm like, I'm either gonna date Hifumi or Makoto. Maybe Kasumi, but Kasumi's like uh, kind of getting down there. <sighs> Hifumi deserves respect, yeah. And that was a two. You're between Hifumi or Makoto. Hifumi enjoys <laughs> have great taste. <laughs> Did a romance anyone because you wanted the cuts and you get when you're single on Valentine's? Wait, that happens? That's kind of hilarious. Or date all of them? That's true. Date bulls. I can't do that to them. I cannot do that to them. Ifumi all the way. Ifumi the phantom, <laughs> phantom thief. <laughs> yeah, Ifumi is great. Emmy, you ended up going with Makoto? Okay. You love a character that unashamedly geeks out over something, right? That's why I like her too. Okay. Um. <clears throat> Next up. Number, what are we at? Seven? Uh, is it Olivia Milkai? Been following your Persona 5 role playthrough on YouTube forever. First time you caught you live. Welcome in. Thanks so much for coming in here. I've been doing wonderful. You went for Makoto Dawn. Has to be Morgana. Please let it be Morgana. It is Morgana this time. Yeah, Morgana is number seven. Listen, I know a lot of people have Morgana very low on their list, okay? Maybe it's because Morgana's a cat, <laughs> but like... I think Morgana's cute. Can he be annoying sometimes? Yes. Can he be rude sometimes? Yes. All the time? Maybe. Um... I don't know, we've, we've been with him forever. We've been with him since the start of the game. I love him. Am you still love Morgana? I don't care. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Mom McCore. Welcome in. How are you? Yeah, yeah, Osuzino. you know, I think Morgana gets on a lot of people's nerves, especially. I think the whole arc with Ryuji and Morgana, that was so freaking annoying. Like, both of them annoyed me so much during that arc. Um, but... It's hard for me to hate Morgana. Stew me? <laughs> Morgana was your 25, holy shit. <laughs> and Olivia Milk, thanks for grabbing your seat. Am I saying your name right? Let me know. 
Okay. Number six. Yo, we're in the top six now. Morgana's a much better... Much better than his mascot counterpart in Persona 4. It's still not your favorite. Okay. How can you be mad at him when he turns into a cute little cat? I know exactly. Exactly. All right, y'all think... An, Futaba, Ryuji... It's on. I love on. Um, on is like another OG. I don't really know what else to say about her. I just love her. You think OG is at top five? The thing with Bragan is he never really grows out of trying to be a you know it all. I feel like he kind of changed. You think Makoto is in the top three? I feel like y'all are going to be surprised by my top three maybe not my top number one <laughs> but but yeah oh jd on is your first you got you got that first cutscene. uh also hi trev welcome in <laughs> i don't know it's a catchy what do you mean i don't know why you guys think that um okay number five number five Ooh, we're in the top five now. This is exciting. Trev, hello, thank you. Trev, I hope you had a good weekend. Makoto? Futaba? All right, Roshi, you think Yusuke is number five. Makoto, four. Futaba, three. Ryuji, two. And you're not even saying number one. <laughs> All right, number five is... Yusuke! Oh, I love Yusuke so much. Um, he's so hilarious to me. Yeah, art boy. Uh, I love how he's just like oblivious. Just so much. And he just like speaks his mind. Um, Ans best scholarship with Joker till this day. Can't believe you have Futaba this high where you are in the game. I love Futaba. I I remember at the beginning of the like when we first got introduced to her, I wasn't a big fan of her, but after Futaba, after I saw like interactions with Futaba and Yusuke, I was like, okay, I actually love this girl. We need to use some more in battle. I know heroes. I feel like I barely use Yusuke. Um, Smoke, thank you so much for the hydrate. Yusuke is a protagonist in his own different Persona game. He really is. He is. <laughs> An and Ryuji is a true ship. Honestly, I I could see An and Ryuji together. 100%. Cambo! Cambo, thank you so much for the five months. I appreciate that. Thank you so much. I hope you're doing well. Yeah, five months worth of seats. It's been so long. All right, Yusuke's at number five. Number four. I feel like I kind of want to change some of these rankings, actually. Okay, we'll just say that this, this is my, my list that I made up over the weekend. It's already changed. <laughs> number four. Hanno, you hated Yusuke in your playthrough? That makes me so sad. Number four, y'all think it's Makoto. It is... Ryuji. I would put him at number two right now. I don't know what I was thinking when I made this. But yeah, I think I would put Ryuji at number two right now. Okay. Um, Makoto at four. Well, who do we think is at three? Yeah, Makoto top three. Yusuke sounds like a creepy 40 year old dude. <laughs> Don't say that about him. <laughs> oh my god. Unless he changes drastically, Ryuji will always be your favorite. Ryuji is the boy. He's like, he's the best boy in Persona 5. 
Just saying. Are you gonna remake this once you finish the game? Yeah, I think so, Katie. Yeah. Um... Y'all think Futaba's at three? Jose, you think Akechi's three? I think Makoto and Ryuji are hands down the best characters in the game. I... I love both of them so much. Number three is Makoto. Hi, Ethan. Good morning. How are you? Thought your top three would be Akechi, Ryuji, Futaba. I mean... You're you're kind of right about that, bees. If we put uh, Ryuji at two right now, Makoto's best wife. This pleases me. Makoto top two and an eight two. <laughs> How does he Makoto so high? I love Makoto so much. Okay, I think her awakening was definitely my favorite. Like, um. When she awakened her persona, that was probably, like, the most emotional out of all of them, in my opinion. Um, I just love how she was like, I'm not going to let people step all over me anymore. Uh, I am my own person. I can be useful. I think she has grown so much. And I, I love it. Wasn't your favorite when she was introduced? No, she definitely wasn't. Um... I was like, girl, you're annoying. Why are you like, why are you trying to be a police cop right now? <laughs> but then, uh, then I started feeling bad for her and then I like understood her character more and yeah. Yeah, yeah, exactly, Dondoms, her character development. With her awakening, we see the build up to it since the first palace ended. Exactly, exactly. One of the most relatable characters in your opinion? I think so too. I'm like, do I really like her because like I can kind of relate to her in a way or what? Um, exactly, yay. She kicks so much ass. The fact that everyone uses weapons, she punches shots in the face with her melee attack. I love her. <laughs> and Adam, thanks for grabbing your seat. Welcome in. Tsunami, so, that's exactly it. She's like, don't you just want to go ape shit? <laughs> Started liking Makoto when we saw how much she has to take from adults, for sure. Um, yeah, when she is talking to the principal, and then even with Kawakami, when Kawakami's like, hey, you actually have to like go on this trip with us and help us. And then from Sai, I'm like, girl, you go through so much. And then she's just so dependable. Like after we got her in our party, um, she's so helpful. So helpful to us. She's not useless at all. She's a group's mom, but she lets the group more or less. Yeah, act like idiots. That's what I think too, Roche. Adam, this is my ranking of the character list for Persona 5 so far. Makoto is more for the school than any of the adults there. You're right, Fura. All right, number two. Number two. Will you play uh, Persona 5 Strikers? I would love to smoke. I don't know when. A catchy for the lows. <laughs> Who could it be? Yeah. Yeah. The good old little sister. Upset of the century. Futaba's number one. I feel like it's it's obvious. We have Futaba at two, and a, our boy Akechi. My boy Akechi is at number one. <laughs> um, yeah, Futaba's story makes me very emotional, and I loved being able to see her open up to us and like her interaction with everyone. So cute. The way that she hears that Joker wasn't able to have like this firework party or like see fireworks that one night and then like the next night she's like hey we're having a fireworks show outside so come light fireworks with us i'm like why are you the cutest the cutest girly ever um <clears throat> aaron hello welcome in bonu planner notebook gonna make a vision board today amazing oh my god like a vision board for 2023 also, hi, Gyrony. 
Strikers has your favorite Ryuji moment. <laughs> Can't wait to come back to the list in like three months. <laughs> Akechi at number one with the title of the stream, shocked and speechless. Yeah. So it's very shocking, isn't it? Um also August Shiro, thanks for the follow. Chotaku, welcome in. Solid God, Asian Bomb, thanks for grabbing your seats. Um uh, just notice the tags. I did add more tags too. What do I have on my stream right now? <laughs> a catchy lover, a catchy fan club, and a catchy enjoyer. <laughs> a catchy suffers from success. He's the most loved yet the most hated. <laughs> I will defend our king. Oh my god. There's... he's just like... I don't know. I... I never thought that I would love a light Yagami lookalike like this. But I do. It's crazy. It's crazy. Uh, are you planning to watch Alice in Borderland ever thought of it? I've actually thought of it. I don't have any plans to watch it right now though. Um, Alana, Akechi, thank you for changing my life. <laughs> I'm literally a video game character. Okay, can I show you this, uh, this gif? It's on my starting soon screen. Look at that. The Joker, I'm outside your house, Joker. It's me, Akechi. <laughs> It is so funny to me. <laughs> Anyways. Um. Hi, Jays. Welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. I know, Ethan. Literally every time I see one of those heart charms. It's so funny. <laughs> it's canon. A lot of this is type and it's a catchy. Again, like, I, I really don't know what it is about him. I just... I love him. Swap... No. Absolutely not. Um... <laughs> Tasty Shark, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. But yeah, that's my list so far. What's today? It's January 9th. We are... 70 hours in. We're on like September 26th. That's my list. Maybe we'll do another one in like two weeks. But yeah. Anyway, should we enter the game? He has the charm. It, he's so charming. He's so charming. <laughs> he's a menace to the society. And Macy, hello, welcome in. Uh, can we to this list once you get through more of the game? Yeah, yeah, yeah. List update every after every palace. That's actually a good idea. I don't know how many more palaces we have left. Two? Three? I don't know. Um, not the Splatfest winners. Get out of here, James and Ethan. We're not going to talk about that. <laughs> A catchy legit the type of person to laugh at you if you tripped. See, I feel like he wouldn't laugh, but he would make a snarky comment. Something about like, oh, I can't believe that you would trip over your feet like that. <laughs> very like passive. A very passive comment. Um Interesting, you have uh Futaba above Makoto. I respect your mistake. <laughs> Aaron, I'm doing good. Any life updates? Not really. I'm just like obsessed with Persona and that's it. You're supposed to step on the ground, not your feet. <laughs> He's saying with a smile too. Akechi would be the one who trips us. Slightly looks at the Akechi. Wow, <laughs> you're so profound. <laughs> It's okay to be obsessed. Yeah, yeah, I'm I'm embracing it. I'm really embracing it. Um, 
Uh, is it Yuxi? Hi, welcome in. How are you? Okay, we've we've been chatting for like an hour and twenty minutes. So we need to get into the game. Um. I'm gonna quick go to the bathroom first, and then I'm gonna let an ad run, so one doesn't run immediately when we start playing the game. Uh, but yeah, thank y'all for hanging out with me. Thank y'all for chatting. Go get some water and get some food. Go to the bathroom, and then we'll get into the game today. And I think we're currently waiting for Akumura's change of heart. And we have like 16 days left, maybe? And when me too. I will literally yell. <laughs> also, is it Ilusu? Hi, thanks for the follow and strike Nas. Thank you as well. I hope you're doing great today. Okay, I'll be right back. Thank you all for watching ads if you do. Um, it really helps out the channel. And yeah, you can check your yeehaws. Check your fruities. Check your misos. Okay, I'll be right back. I need y'all to look at this picture of me, so... Um... Also, I think I'm out of focus. Come on, camera. Oh no! 
<laughs> this is fine. Hi, Camila. Welcome in. How are you? Also, hi, Jedi and M. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Macy, hello. Thanks for grabbing your seat, too. Oh, uh, please, camera. Please focus. There we go. Miso is adorable, and I just took a picture of him. And I'm going to try to bring it up on stream so you can see the state of him right now. Um, okay. He's so cute. <laughs> this is me so right now. He's just laying in the sun. <laughs> Oh no. Oh no. The chat. <laughs> Yo, Asian Bomb! Thank you so much for the five gifted subs. What the hell? I appreciate that. Yo, if you got a gifted sub, enjoy. I feel like your emotes and your sub badge. I know. Look at the little toe beans. Look at that! He looks so soft. I love he. I love he. Okay. Anyway, let me open the game. Um, Asian Mom, thank you so much again for the five gifted subs. Holy cow. Uh, Y'all enjoy. Enjoy your gifted sub if you got one. All right. Let's play some Persona. I'm very excited for today. I think we're going to rank up some confidants. I don't know if we'll be able to... Um, hit when Okumura has his change of heart because I remember last time we were ranking up confidants and stuff. It took a long time and there's lots of reading too, so we'll see. We'll see how we do. Let me turn on this music. Um Yes, let's connect to the Thieves Guild. Oh shit, is that loud? Seems very loud to me. Um, <clears throat> also, hi Max, welcome in. How are you? And Nier, thank you so much for grabbing your seat. Not loud? Okay. A 12 hour mementos stream today. I don't know if I could go to the mementos for 12 hours, but. All right. How many hours are we? Okay, we're 68 hours in. <laughs> We're almost 69 hours in. Uh, hi, Severino. Welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. All right. Okay, so we have 17 days until heart is sold off. So we have to await the change of heart. If you missed last stream on Thursday, we fought Okumura. We finished Okumura's palace. Um, that was such an annoying boss. And I'll, if you missed it, <laughs> I used a really high level DLC persona. And thank God I did, because I think I would still be fighting him today okay. if I didn't do that. Um, okay, so what I want to focus on today is obviously ranking up confidence, and I also want to rank up my kindness. Uh, so I don't think we can go out. Hey. Yeah, we can't go out. Can we make some curry? Okay, we're out of ingredients. Since we want to rank up my kindness, let's clean. Um, yeah, it's time to go on some dates. I'm excited. Also, Sabrina, thanks for lurking. Happy Okumura if I did make you want to quit the game for good. If I didn't have the DLC personas, I think I would. To be quite honest. That should do it for now. We're still only empathetic. What DLC hey. persona? Yeah, it was uh, Izanagi no Picaro, like the level 89 one. Absolutely not, Roche. Oh shit, okay, we're going to the velvet, velvet room? Huh. 
Looks like we made a great miscalculation, inmate. I also just realized I wasn't recording. Okay. My apologies. Contrary to our assumptions, it seems you have turned out to be quite promising. Your powers continue to grow, as do the relationships you hold with your contractors. It seems the rehabilitation is proceeding at a fine rate. It's going well? You are quite the cautious one. Allow me to warn you on one matter. Being at the peak may mean you are mere moments from your downfall. Igor. Unexpected situations are necessary in a game, after all. <laughs> Why is he laughing like that? <laughs> I don't like it. <gasps> oh wait, this is a mementos thing, right? <gasps> what the hell? <laughs> oh, it's another dream, okay. <laughs> Uh, 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 dream again. What the hell? I'm human. I have to be. I... There's no way I was born like that. Mm -hmm. I won't let myself get worked up over some dream. I'm sure everything will be clear if we can get to the depths of Mementos. Morgana's like, you gotta go to the Mementos. <laughs> okay. Just, yeah, normal human things from Morgana. Yeah. Okay, so the fan site ratings have went up to 88%. Hmm. <laughs> Igor, very motivational. Also, hi Astro, welcome in. Tina, what the frick is that? Tina, thank you for the 20 months and thank you for using your prime here. How are you? Are you at work today? I hope doing well, Tina. I love you. Wow, people are saying Akechi-kun is finished. People really do not like Akechi. Well, then. And now we wait, like usual. That's not an excuse to slack off. We should still use our time wisely. Well, then. Oh yeah, the shopping program hey. is on today. Uh, shouldn't you tell the others about that target in the Mentos? Who messaged us? God damn it. Okay, it's fine. Oh my god, so many people want to talk to me. Okay, first. <sighs> Makoto. Uh, we're gonna decide later. Decide later for Yusuke. I'm like, I'm so popular. Um, <laughs> hi Toffly, <laughs> welcome in. <laughs> hi Oceanic Jump, do I like Akechi? I don't know, do I? All right, Phantom Thief set, Calming Aroma and a Smoke Screen, ooh, and Lockpicks. A Thief Fun set, Phantom Wafers and Calling Postcards. Hey, hey! Um... I think I'll get this one. Well then. All right. So let's see who we can go talk to. God damn it! I really want to get my kindness up so I can rank up with Futaba. <laughs> go solve four of them. My favorite part of this game is I get to pretend I have a, yeah, a busy social life. Uh, alright. So I can't really rank up with anyone. Freezy that I can spend time with everyone at like the the darts place And we can kind of get some more More friendship with them there So we're gonna do this 
Welcome. Hey. What are you Darts playing? or billards? Would you like to play darts or billards? It's 800 yen to play all you want. Darts? Time will pass if you play darts. However, you will have the ability to invite your teammates to play with you. Playing together will help you bond and strengthen the effects of baton pass. Playing darts with your friends may improve your baton pass with multiple party members. You can view your party members' baton pass rank when choosing who you will invite to play darts. You can also see how your party members play darts by pressing X. You can also play darts by yourself. You won't be able to increase the bonds with your teammates, but you can practice as much as you'd like. Right. What do you want to do? Yes. Let's call someone. Wow, so we need to... We need to rank all these guys up, huh? Also, hi, Potato. Welcome in. Freezy giving off-stream spoilers. I asked how I can rank up my confidence better. So I feel like I haven't really been taking full advantage of all the, all the stuff I can do in the game. But also, if any of you have advice on how to rank up my confidants better, let me know. Just like, without spoilers, obviously. Um... Can I invite all of them? I <laughs> call Makoto? Hey, hey! Thank you! I'm bringing over Makoto. Oh, they're all here! Well then! Okay, we're playing 0-1. We have five rounds to bring our score down to zero. Okay. By doing it as a pair, the Phantom Thieves teamwork will strengthen. Hey! Let's begin. Hey! Hey, Akira, can we go first? I like to test this technique I found up. As for the rule, let's try 301. It's best to start with the basics, no? I don't know what that means. Let's do this. As long as you stay calm, you should be fine. Oh god, oh, okay, we're playing darts. Done, thank you for redeeming space cowboy time. This reminds me of um, Final Fantasy VII remake when we had to play some darts. You can also invite confidence to the jazz club. Can I invite a catchy again? Um, main tip is to have a persona of their confidant type in your party for that's what I was gonna do as well I need to make more con I need to make more personas with the confidant types uh, Osagori hi, thanks for the follow Okay, hold down RT to decide where to throw if your aim shifts you can reset by pressing Y Input A to throw the dart at the targeted area Okay. Okay. Your skill will be determined by the challenges. Press LB to view certain conditions. Aim to be a highly skilled darts player. All right then. Yo, what the fuck is this? Oh. Okay. For real? Bullseye! I have to do this in five rounds? for the triple 30. Um... Slay. Slay. Low ton? Alright, we're switching now. Alright. It's my turn. Now if I just do it like the simulations. I'll give it a try. Oh, they're like, they're baton passing. 
Okay, round two. <laughs> you know what? Nice try. Nice try, Makoto. Calm down. It's already round three. Make sure to stay focused. I'll leave it to you. Um, hi, gaming K Dog. Thanks for the follow. Okay, so we have we have two more rounds. Yes. I see. Can I just miss? Can I miss? Because I'm like, I'm afraid. I'm afraid that... Well, um... I'm gonna go over. So how the heck did she get... Oh, wait, 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 I see, I see, I see. Okay, okay. I understand now. You're right. Okay, now we're at an even 90. I see. I'll give it a try. Second to last round. <laughs> you look you like this minigame? If you have a low score by round 4, your teammate may ask for advice on how they should finish. Answering correctly increases the possibility that they will perform a finishing throw. When your teammate finishes in this way, your synergy with that teammate increases, leveling up your baton pass rank by 2. Don't tell me. We could finish it right here. I have to remember the simulations. <sighs> Just take it easy. Or wait, should we ask what simulations? Ugh. Uh, oh, um, do I have to explain little... that right now? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, god damn it, I, I pressed the wrong thing. <laughs> I'm so sure this life I wait. Incredible. Oh, so we don't need to get zero exactly at round five. We can just end it whenever. We have five rounds we can get to zero, but we don't have to end it at round five. Okay. Got it. The positive effects of synergy between two people yield unexpectedly strong results. Yes, I feel great. Rank three? We're already maxed out. <laughs> what do you think? Okay. How are things with on? Yeah, yeah. What do you think? Let's do it. Insta max. That's crazy. Also, Parker, hello. And Itsuki, welcome in. Goat, hi, welcome in. Ellie, hello. Sounds How are you? Okay, 301. Yes. Yay! For real? God damn. Hat trick. Wowie. Um, upgrading baton I'm passes might be the uh most OP royal <laughs> change. All right, on you got this. I'll give it a go. Got this. Nice one. All right, we're at eighty four. Yes. Counting on you. So I'm thinking I don't want to finish it here because we want on to finish it out because I think that would rank us up more. So like... Wow! 
there. Huh. I'm just gonna give her a nice even yeah. 80. This is my last round. Gotta make sure I don't screw it up. I'll give it a go. For real? We can finish it right here. I think I'm nervous. <laughs> oh, just play like normal. Thanks. All right. Yeah, that's all you can really do. All right, on. Shit. <gasps> Let's go. She's so good. That was so much fun. Zero points exactly. Do we make an awesome team or what? I could feel you were counting on me, so I had to try really hard. <laughs> yes. Amazing. <laughs> uh Whooper Dead, nice. hi, thanks for grabbing your seat. Welcome in. And Fantalis, hi. I like the idea of Joker not finishing on turn three to help give his yeah a teammate's confidence boost. I love it. Okay. Performing well, like pulling off a hat trick or high ton, will increase your proficiency at the end of a darts game. Hmm. So this that gives us lots well of proficiency. The sensation of throwing darts, I don't dislike that it. should do it for now. Okay, so... See you later. We'll have to work on Yusuke and someone else later. Um, also Don, thanks for lurking, uh, I appreciate it. You're back. Who's messaging me? Hey, inmate! You haven't forgotten about your special assignment, have you? You better not keep us waiting, we're waiting in front of our door. I have a special assignment? That creep hasn't tried anything funny, right, Haru? No, I'm okay. Thank you for asking, Anshan. Mother did say he'd rescind the marriage offer as well. I'm a bit worried, though. There's still some time before the deadline. If anything happens, be sure to let us know. Thanks, Mako-chan. I will gladly rely on all of you. There's also the matter of the mental shutdowns. I hope no danger comes to Haru. I guess Haru's dad did say that he was just making requests. The true culprit is still out there, triggering mental shutdowns in exchange for money. You gotta catch whoever it is. Any idea who that culprit might be, Akira? Yeah, the black masked person. We actually saw him at the end of Okumura's palace. And he killed the shadow Okumura. Which is not good news. Yes, they're definitely the most likely perpetrator. Either way, I'm sure we'll learn more once Haru's father speaks up about it. We just gotta wait for his change of heart. Taba's right. We don't have any intel now, so there's nothing we can do. Let's wait for Okumura's change of heart, then pursue the truth behind the mental shutdowns. There haven't been any mental shutdown cases lately, right? Not since Okumura took first place in the rankings. Perhaps the culprit behind them is being cautious due to the success we've had recently. So it's cause of us. Damn, I'm glad we're famous. But it's highly probable they'll become active again. Especially if they think the Phantom Thieves aren't actively attempting to do anything. But we're also gonna be in trouble if we let public opinion go down the path it's heading. Yes, there have been a great deal more instigating, instigating comments lately, and we're all trying so hard. Our inactivity must be upsetting. We should keep that in mind. Okay. Cowgirl Lana fastest start in the West. I'm gonna take this off now. Okay, so it's Sunday evening. I'm wondering if the juice bar is still open. In um Shibuya. Shibuya? Can we go out there? Okay. Oops, I don't want to go there. 
Uh, we want to go to the underground mall. I have a tip to make your life easier with confidence. Mind if I tell you? Sure. Yeah, also, uh, back at Alex. Thanks for the mod love. Um... I actually think I wanted to go to the underground station. Or wait, yeah, the underground walkway. That's what it is. No. Wait. Yeah, it is here. Hello. Hi. Um. Ooh. We can get more oh. guts. <laughs> nice. What is it? <laughs> Alright, cool. You can level their affinity even if you don't raise your confident level and you hang out with them. Doing so will unlock the ability to level up later, later their confidant rank. Also, Chahaya can be helpful for the affinity. That's right. I think, um... I remember Freezy said something about Chahaya being able to help with that as well. Okay, we can't do anything with EY. Um, we can also go to the jazz club. Hey, hey! You hang out with Chihaya a few times first? Okay. I was trying to remember Jahaya's name earlier, kept thinking Chifuyu. That was me over the weekend. I was like, what's her name? Is it Chifuyu? Chifuya? Uh, at this point in the store, you can buy postcards from Central Street. Wait, what are the postcards for? Hmm. It's the jazz club that Akechi introduced you to. Places like this help you relax and talk about things that you'd usually find difficult to. As the leader of the Phantom Thieves, maybe you can invite one of the members here. I wonder what everyone's up to. Looks like for miners, they will serve non-alcoholic cocktails. I see. Hmm, looks like tonight's cocktail is constant trade. Today's original drink, maybe you'll be able to discover a new side of yourself, maybe one you never knew about. Sounds pretty good. Looks like there are days a singer comes in. The singer's coming in on 9.30. Drinking cocktails while listening to live music sounds pretty adult, huh? Okay. Team members you invite to the jazz club, ooh, will have their persona strengthened, as well as receiving other helpful effects. These effects differ depending on what day of the week you visit. If you visit the jazz club on a day when a live singer performs, a special cocktail will be served. Also, the effects of the cocktail will be doubled if it's a weekday. What do you want to do? So maybe we should wait till it's a weekday. I see. What do you want to do? Yeah, I'm gonna wait. Um, hi Winter in Tokyo, welcome in. And Pepstrella, hi. Uh, from YouTube, catching a first time catching a stream, welcome in. How are you? Thanks for saying hi. You can send them for, through the mail. Oh, for a free confidant boost. Okay. We're gonna look so sad that he couldn't do some underage drinking, right? <laughs> Alright, I think I know what I want to do, actually. I want to go back to the cafe. Maybe I'll just, like... Hmm. Lift weights or workout or something. Because I think that will raise my HP. Yeah, we can train. Oh, you want to do it? Will it all it <laughs> yes. Uh, moist protein? Imported protein? Let's take some moist protein. Moist protein, huh? You have five of those. How about it? Let's take it. 
Bruh. Let's carry out our plan. <laughs> Thank you so much for the two months of using your Prime stuff here. I appreciate that. Any Prime gamers in the chat? Okay. Oh, come on. You're stronger than that. <laughs> nice going. All right. <gasps> nice. Max HP increased by five. All right. <gasps> and, well, and more. Joker's gonna be shredded, absolutely. <gasps> Kazumi! Cruz is sent by, thank you so much. What are you talking about? I'm sorry, I'm just so happy. I just got out of that meet I was talking to you about and my routine was the best I've ever given so far, so I just wanted to thank you for that. Why me? You're the reason I've come so far, Senpai. You helped me so much, even with mundane things. I just can't thank you enough. Please, I want to thank you again. As soon as I get the results, I'll let you know. I'll be missing you again sometime soon. Now I better get going. Have a good night. So cute. <laughs> um, you left me out of your top 10. <laughs> good morning. Oh my god, I thought it was going to be a catchy. <laughs> That's really good, thanks. How are you? Hopping between your persona. Oh, and 10 bonds. Nice. I'm doing good. I'm glad that you're doing good as well. And Gyro, thank you for redeeming Pochita time. Yeah, Mr. Pochita right here. All right. Hi, Makoto. The palace is gone, so I guess we're waiting for a while. What do you guys do at times like these? Take a break. I see. I suppose it'll do us good to take it easy every now and then. Still, don't go overboard. You can't forget your primary duties as a high schooler. It's important to play the part of a diligent student, right? True. Alright. We have 15 days. Ooh. Maruki. We have Maruki and Takemi. Let's see. We can't level up with any of them? Okay. Uh, look at this! <laughs> look at that! That's so cool! Someone is talented. Okay, I have another pineapple question. Is it worth it to talk to my confidants even if I can't rank up with them? It is? It is worth it? Okay. I will probably go talk to Maruki then. Yeah, let's go. Brings you closer to leveling you up? Okay. It uh, means they will rank up next time. All right. Yeah, we'll go talk to Maruki. <gasps> Hi! Welcome. It's already autumn. You'd expect to get a little less hot, huh? Do you maybe have time today? If you want mine, can I borrow you for a chat? I've got snacks too. Hmm. Let's go help him out. It's open. Um, Haley, hello. How was your meeting? Be uh, careful, I love okay? <laughs> the classroom drawings are usually related to current plot points. Oh, they're like little Easter eggs. Okay. Yeah, I did see the Big Bang Burger on there. It was fun. Ah, uh, you're back. Father has begun acting a little odd lately. He's been cooped up in his study and his voice lacks energy. That actually sounds quite similar to what Madarame went through. And Madarame still had a change of heart in the end, don't worry, Haru. Is that so? Oh, my apologies, I don't mean to doubt you or anything. Nobody was accusing you of that. People just act a bit weird after their treasures get stolen. It'd be hard not to worry about such a sudden shift. It'll be okay, Haru. Right. Hmm, I feel better now after consulting with you all. Thank you. Looks like this Okumura case is finally going to have a happy ending. All that we have to do now is wait for his change of heart. Yo. Okay, we got our order. 
Oh. I. <laughs> I think since um. Yo, Pac Alex, thank you so much for gifting our sub. And it went to Jesse. Jesse, enjoy your gifted sub of you here. Also, Raiden, thank you so much for lurking. I appreciate it. Yeah, hi, Kiambo. I am biracial. I am. Since Okumura's shadow was literally killed, doesn't that mean he's gonna have a mental shutdown? But don't, don't say anything. Don't tell me. I don't think this is gonna have a happy ending. <laughs> Anyways. Okay, can we call Kawakami? Yes, let's call Kawakami. Oh, oops. Oh my god. You know what? Let's talk to Sojiro. You got time right now? Yeah. All right then. I have mental shutdowns every day, and I'm not dead, so. <laughs> not Burger Bezos. Is Kawakami still accepting Thanks. our calls after being ranked so low on the list? <sighs> Bravo, she better. She better still be accepting our calls. Ooh, a new fall fragrance. It's supposed to be mysterious, like the Phantom Thieves. A fangirl? No way. I thought I'd wear it to show my support while they're out taking down an evil corporation. A show of support, huh? I could post a photo online of all the fan merch I've amassed. Maybe they'll be motivated by how passionate their fans are. <laughs> Astral, no problem. Enjoy your lunch. Also, hi, Cal. Hey! Okay. Hello there. Hello there, Karuzakun. There's something I'd like to discuss with you. It's about my research. Do you think you could set aside some time right now? I think we'll be able to rank up with him. Welcome. Really? Not yet? Okay. Okay, I'm so sorry, Murky. Let's go see if we can talk to someone else. Virgin. Aiko? <gasps> Our bond with Makoto will grow stronger soon? Okay, we're gonna go see Makoto. Actually... Apparently Aiko has started dating a host from a club near her work. I guess he um, hit on her one day after her shift and that was that. Since then, he's the only thing she'll talk about. Ooh. She even sent me a picture of their date at Destiny Land. That's annoying. Hmm. Honestly, it's difficult to have that reaction seeing how happy they were in that picture. But knowing the line of work her boyfriend is in, I'm worried that he might be deceiving her. For now, it seems he hasn't forced her to spend any money at his club, but I'm still nervous. Beyond that, he calls her his princess and constantly tells her how special she is. It makes me sick to my stomach. <sighs> but Aiko refuses to listen to me. She said the idea that, that all hosts are bad people is outdated. She even said she was shocked to be getting advice from someone who would totally flunk a test about love. Aww. Tests about love aren't a thing though, and even if they were, I most certainly wouldn't flunk them. <laughs> Sorry about that. I'm probably just being biased towards him. I mean, I don't have any proof that he's untrustworthy, but that's why I want to meet him and find out for myself what kind of person he really is. And if it's not too much to ask, I'd like you to accompany me on this excursion as well. Me? Uh, well... This time, um, you'll have to play the role of my boyfriend. <laughs> I got this? Why do I have to do it? Or only if I can take it seriously? What the fuck am I supposed to do? <sighs> Hi, Mussy Baby, an epic lab, Makinchi, welcome in. I'm so torn. 
between Hifumi and Makoto right now. I got this. It's honestly okay. You're so reliable, Akira kun. I think if I have a boyfriend, Aiko might be more inclined to listen actually... to me. <laughs> to tell you the truth, I actually already made plans with her and her boyfriend for a double date. Sorry, but it's just going to be a diner. Nothing particularly fancy, I promise. Thank you. You're a tremendous, you're a tremendous help. I'm so glad you agreed to this. I don't know who else I'd have asked if you said no. So, are we gonna see this date? All right, we're at rank five. Right. Uh, Ren, hi, thank you for the follow. I go, I hope she's not getting herself wrapped up in anything dangerous, but just in case, I'll try looking for some info on that host. All right then. <laughs> yeah, we have a lot of Makoto stands in chat. I think we all love Makoto here, honestly. Sorry I had to ask something so unreasonable. I appreciate you going along with it, though. Do you think Aiko's really okay? I hope I'm just being paranoid about her boyfriend. But if it turns out he really is toying with Aiko, what should we do? <laughs> Fist of justice. No, try to re reach out to her. You're right, we're friends now, so I'm sure she'll understand if I can just have an honest talk with her. Phew, I keep thinking in circles here. I need to stop dwelling on the negative. Let's see who this host is behind his smile, for Aiko's sake. Okay, I'll call you again later. <laughs> ah, you're back. Father was cooped up in his study again today. His reaction was quite vague when I spoke to him too. Is this what normally happens? Madarami was in a similar state after we changed his heart. It'll be okay, don't worry. All we have to do is wait. You're right, I'll just believe it's going to work. Thank you, and sorry for asking so many times. I'll message you again if there is more progress. I get why Haru is worried, but let's just wait for the change of heart to go through. Don't worry, it'll be just like it always is. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, yeah. Oh yeah. Uh... Let's see. Okay, we can rank up with Sojiro. Let's rank up with Sojiro. Hi Cortez, welcome in. You default to Fists of Justice all the time. <laughs> all right, let's help him out. Oh, Futaba's coming too. Cute. I'm wicked full. How was the curry, Futaba? Delicious. I'm gonna be dreaming of that stuff tonight. Um, did it taste as the same? Did it taste the same as you remember it? Yep, I feel like a dummy for not wanting to eat it back when I was depressed about my mom. Oh, that's right. Oh yeah, the first episode of this brand new anime I wanna watch is airing tonight. I'm out of here. Eyes in front when you walk, okay? <laughs> no spacing out. You ran headfirst into a pole last time you went for a walk. Well, you stubbed your toe on the dresser the other day. Oh crap, it's gonna start. Making like a leaf and... Eh, screw it, bye. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> she thought it was delicious. And what about you? I think I'm addicted. Really? I guess you have pretty good taste if you can understand how incredible that curry is. Now then, there's something I should probably tell you. Here, take a seat. I'll pour you some coffee. What's he gonna tell me? Yeah. Remember how I said the recipe for this curry was developed by a scientific genius? Oh, you might have realized by now, but that genius was Futaba's mother, Wakaba. In other words, that curry is one of the last remaining connections Futaba has to her mom. I first met Wakaba back when I was doing work for the government. So Jiro was working for the government? She was real trouble, let me tell you. Logic prevailed over emotion for her, and she had an intricate knowledge of the human mind. I thought my pickup lines were the best in town, but not a single one worked on her. Hm. Was she like Futaba? She wasn't normal. Was she like Futaba? 
You could say that. It was never clear that what she was thinking, so I had a hard time trying to keep up with her. Men are idiots, though. We spend our time chasing after things we can't get. Wakaba rejected me time and time again, but there was one instance I managed to surprise her, and that was when I gave her a plate of my homemade curry. The very next day, she came asking all about the ingredients and what goes into the cooking process. Then, just a few days later, she handed me a scientifically enhanced version of my recipe. It was incredible. She had used my curry as a basis, but it was miles better than anything I made. Curry was Wakaba's specialty from then on. Naturally, Futaba grew to love it in no time as well. But then, after Wakaba's accident, Futaba stopped eating it entirely. The flavor would make her remember the pain. I've heard even smells can bring back memories too. That's true. But that curry was the only point of connection I had with Futaba. That's why when I took her in, I vowed to keep this recipe alive until she could eat it again. Mm. That almost brings a tear to my eye. <laughs> I wasn't trying to creep him out. <laughs> The whole idea of pairing the curry with a nice brew is thanks to Akaba's refinement, too. Despite how introverted she seemed, she was extraordinarily perceptive of the people around her. I never even told her about my love of coffee. She figured it out just from looking at me. That was when I realized she was totally out of my league. Not like I really stood a chance to begin with, though. She already had Futaba by then, after all. This might seem like any old curry to most people, but there are tons of emotions crammed inside. So, uh, make sure you keep the tradition going. I will! I will. Also, hi, a precious soul. Thanks for the follow. And Alex, thanks for redeeming Gojo Cat. Wow, we're at rank 5 with Sojiro now? Alright. Things are getting downright sappy in here. Futaba's waiting for me at home, too. I should probably be heading back. Is on you. Make sure you clean up before you go to bed. <gasps> My kindness is growing! How freaking long is it gonna take for me to rank up my kindness? Hey, it's me. You finished cleaning up? Futaba's still watching anime. As long as she's in a good mood, though, I don't mind it. Seeing her so happy makes me glad I kept Waka Wakaba's curry alive. It's only a problem when she asks for it three times a day. <laughs> Sounds good to me. Don't you start on that. You gotta think about balanced nutrition and all that stuff. I gotta be strict with her. She needs to eat balanced meals so she gets vitamins that curry can't give her. But man, the expression on Futaba's face when she took a bite of that curry... Eh, forget it. Maybe I'll have to stick with curry as a staple, but I can sneak in some veggies here and there. Guess cooking really can be a labor of love. Why is he so sweet? <sighs> Crap, I talk too much. See you later, I guess. Man. Also, Minion, hello. Thanks for grabbing your seat. We were able to grab a seat. Can I read something? Um, guts. Can I reread books? Hey. Oh no. Hmm. Let's just read this one. Hmm? Oh. Ooh, Monomachi Chinatown. The picture really shows how lively that place is. Everything from high class traditional cuisine to street food, like Zhou Long Bao. It seems like a fun place to explore and try out all the different cuisine. Hmm. He really is a walking library, isn't he? His bag must be yeah. heavy. Oh, cool, so that unlocks places for us. Sweet. We unlock Chinatown, Japan's largest Chinatown. Gourmet Chinese restaurants line the streets. 4,000 years of history. Take a walk through a foreign city. Enjoy the stall foods, the stall food and souvenirs. All right. Cool. Um, you keep hoping Persona 6 is college students? Yeah, I wonder. I wonder what it's gonna be. Hey there. <gasps> Perky, good morning. Hmm. There are lots of students here at this hour. It's refreshing to make the commute to work. 
Make the work commute at a different time every now and then. Running late? Hi, <laughs> <laughs> you caught me. On my way to work today, I ran into these old ladies carrying some heavy luggage. Three of them, in fact. He helped them. So I was offering to help carry their things, but then my back made, <laughs> made the sound that it shouldn't make. Well, anyway, have you heard the news from Yoshisawa's on? <laughs> I'm so happy for her. It makes me feel like I'm doing my best, too. Oh, it makes me feel like doing my best, too. Of course, as I say that, I'm running late. Well, hey, we all need to switch it up every now and then, so let's do our best for today, shall we? I can't believe I ever doubted Murky. I skipped breakfast, so now I'm hungry. Have you seen the totem pole at the diner in Shibuya yet? Yeah, it really is a totem pole. It's so colorful, I just love watching people try to eat it. You know those people who can eat it without falling over? I'd never be able to do that. Mm. Eating a totem pole without it falling over? I wonder why they call it the totem pole. Probably the way it looks. Man. Well, what does it look like? You didn't really think about that, did you? Eating without it falling over, you might be able to improve your proficiency there. The totem pole at the diner, huh? We should go there at least once and see what it's all about. Hmm. Also, hi, Skamunculus. Welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. And Pookie, hello. How are you? Oh, have you heard? I need a persona that takes place at a retirement home. <laughs> oh my god. Have you ever thought your phone went off but nothing actually happened? It seems so many of us have experienced this term has experienced this that a term has been created for it. The English name for that particular phenomenon can be abbreviated to PBS. Would anyone like to tell me what that stands for? I need an answer. Um... Uh... P... Phantom. V... Vibration. Syndrome. This is it. Good. Oh my god, I'm so smart. This is an affliction that can only affect a modern society where being connected 24-7 is commonplace. Nice go. I'm on a roll. I'm on a roll today. When I was a student, I get all worked up waiting for my significant other to call me at night. Nowadays, people complain if you don't reply to a text you just saw. Kind of obnoxious if you ask me. Think I'll ever get to a point where we'll be able to read each other's minds? I'll pass on that, thanks. <laughs> Is he really a criminal? I know. Are they still asking that? Ooh. Okay, Kasumi. And we have on. Oh lord. Oh lord, okay, okay. Ryuji on... Takemi. We can't rank up with anyone. Okay, pause. Let me check, um... My confidence. Oh my god, we're only at rank 3 with Yusuke? That kind of makes me sad. Only rank 1 with Futaba. Okay, before I go anywhere, I think I'm gonna go to the Velvet Room. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the Velvet Room. I wanna make some personas that can help me out with getting my confidant ranks up. And then we can see who we can talk to after that. So, I need to go to Shibuya. Wait. I school some weird Japan nostalgic golden time. I get enough from anime. <laughs> no, yeah, I get that. I get that. Sam, you've had phantom vibration syndrome so many times. Honestly, me too. Hey, inmate. I love how they're just kicking us in there. Didn't they also want to talk to me about something? You certainly seem composed. Time for some rehabilitation. Okay. Persona fusion. Let us begin the search. 
Um, sort by Arcana. Is there a way I can look at my art, my personas right now? You change your mind? You'd like to read the compendium? These are the paths you have walked. These are the paths Sean, you have walked. Thank you so much for the two months and for using your prime here. I really appreciate that. Happy New Year to you. How are you doing today? Uh wait, why did I do that? Toggle list. Alright, I have a pineapple question. Is there a way for me to see Are you easily which what? um Which pers which confidants need personas? Oops. You just look in the regular menu. Okay. Personas. So we have two more spaces left. We have two of the hanged personas, so I feel like we can get rid of one. Okay. How fares your progress? Time for some rehabilitation. You wish to perform an what path do you want? I think Justice? I think Akechi is a Justice Arcana. Oh, this confuses me. Look at the Arcanas in the Confidant menu, match them to Personas you summon and fuse. Yeah, that makes sense, yeah. Ended up making a spreadsheet with all our Personas and their ability types. See you know where I was covered, M? I feel like I might have to do that, to be quite honest. Finished for done already. What? Oh my god, okay. Personas. I don't think we have an Emperor persona. Emperor, Chariot, Justice, Strength. Okay, we do have Chariot. We need Emperor, Strength, Priestess, Justice. Okay, let's just see if we can make one of those. You wish to perform an execution. Let us begin the search. Priestess? Okay, we can make a Priestess one. Okay with this? Mm. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Let's take relief bloodline. Okay, cool. Receive some new power. Now yeah, let's do this. Rebirth. Um, strength, sun, and moon don't need matching personas. Okay. Oh, and full of magician. A lot of times you start talking to a confidant, realize you didn't have a persona, and nope, back to the velvet room. And that was your biggest misstep in your first playthrough. I know, I like. I didn't really re remember that. 
until this past weekend. I was like, I guess I could have personas with me that match them up. And I'm what, like 70 hours into this game, just realizing it now? All right, sweet. So this is a barrier that nullifies an instant insta-kill for all allies one time. I don't think I want that. Okay, let's see if we can make a justice one. Okay, we can't. Let us begin the search. Not terrible, but not impressive. So, Emperor, this can be for Yusuke. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. <gasps> Ooh. All oh, these are all so nice. There's intense focus, skillful technique, and glutton mouth. The game doesn't really explicitly point out this mechanic. Yeah. Heavy network fusion. Oh, um, I've done that once. Or, like, I looked at it once. Best not to stress that stuff on the first playthrough. Yeah, third heaven, that's true. Just do what seems fun, right. Um... We're gonna take intense focus. It will receive a fraction of girls. Sure. Let us begin. Uh, Lucifer, hi, thanks for the follow. Also, hi, Andy. Welcome in. Are you gonna become a Persona 5 speedrunner after this? How the heck do you speedrun this game? I can't imagine. I think I remember asking, like, what the current speedrun is for this game, and it's, what, like, 40 hours or something? Maybe less? Terrible, but not impressive. Mm. Well, how's this gonna go? <gasps> yes. Okay, this is what we want. You can't handle this. Okay, so we can get rid of a hanged persona and we can get a justice persona. Not terrible. Select the skills you'd like to inherit. Uh <sighs> Oh, look at all this. Okay. Let's take fire. Ice, wind. It will receive <gasps> wait, 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 never mind. I think we want bless damage. It will receive significant power. Let's definitely get the bless damage. Strengthens all magic skills by 25%. Let's get that too. And then for the final one. Let's it take will wind. Receive significant power. Then let us begin. Jay, hello, welcome in. Good afternoon. How are you? Wait, 18 hours and 47 minutes? That is what it takes for a speed run? Also, hi, I mean, welcome in. Too much companion, not enough comprehendium. I am power. I shall be one with this mask and protect you with my life as though I were an iron shield. Power is cool. The Justice Confidant. Thank you so much, Ketchy. Wow. <gasps> Bless boost too. I have acquired a special skill. Almighty boost? Mm. 
Okay, we're gonna take that. Wow. <laughs> yeah, power looks different there. <laughs> Finished for now. The inmate needs Wait, can we make one more? Oh my god, we can make so many! Oh lord. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. I feel like I need to go get more. You know? Otherwise, if I keep making them, they're just gonna keep going away, right? Finished so... Are you finished? What? Yeah, I wanna go back. No yeah, we can grind off. some mementos. Not sure when, but it'll happen. Maybe this stream, actually. Okay, cool. So... Kasumi? Let's go talk to Kasumi. Hey girl. Senpai? Oh, Senpai. It's starting to get cold. I guess that means autumn's here. If you have time, would you like to do some stretches with me? Mm -hmm. What do you want to do? Let's hang out. Yes. <gasps> Where should we go? We could go to the aquarium. I'm sorry. I don't want to go to the aquarium with anyone else but Akechi. So let's go to the shrine. Yeah. <laughs> yes, let's go there. Oh, that's true. We could buy personas too. So anyway. Custom mid roach stuff. Do you do you go to places like this often? When I have a wish, sure. That makes sense, I guess. It's about the same for me. I may have told you this before, but whenever I had a huge competition, my little sister would bring me here. Now that I think about it, I guess I'm pretty superstitious. Oh, since we're here, let's pray. It couldn't hurt, right? Mm -hmm. I'll be heading home now. Hey, hello. How are you? Thanks for grabbing your seat. Ah, you're back. Things are getting really crazy online. The Phantom of Thieves have been trending all over the country. Not a day passes that I don't hear people talking about the Phantom of Thieves in the city, too. That just means people are really starting to count on us, right? This fervor may be too extreme. It is a dangerous omen. Honestly, Yusuke? I agree. We could face great danger if anyone manages to discover our true identities. Don't scare us like that. Ain't no way somebody's gonna figure that out. Either way, this excitement has definitely piqued the public's interest in the Phantom Thieves. We'll need to be even more careful from now on. Why do we gotta be the ones who sneak around? It don't make sense. Ooh. Ifumi and Kawakami. And Pookie, thanks for grabbing your seat. Um. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm deciding between Makoto or Hifumi. I wish Akechi was, was an option. Haley, you love this game? Me freaking too. Haley, I can't believe you're so far. I wonder if there'll be more inclusive for dating options in the next game. I hope so. I really hope so. Um, also, Kay, thank you. Yeah, Persona's going great. <laughs> you wanna play? Do you think you'll play on your lunch break? Or tonight? Uh, okay. Let's see. I'm sorry. I have to rank up with Ifumi. <sighs> this is taking a lot of mental fortitude right now. <laughs> oh! She was happy to see me in Hawaii, and you came to see me today, too? I'm sorry. I'm not in the mood to teach Shogi today. Could you join me for a walk? <laughs> Thank you very much. You aren't the real one, I know! 2016 was the last possible year that gave away much without much scrutiny. 
Oh, yeah, with uh, the dating options and stuff. Okay, so I was thinking of going to the area around the sky tree today. Let's head on over. Oh my god. <sighs> that, that's self control. It was a lot. Anyway, Asakusa and Oshiaga. Oshiage? A popular old town area known for the Sensoji Temple and Tokyo Sky Tree. Tourist heaven. Nakamize Dori is a hit with tourists. Colorful shops of all kinds line the streets. All right. Okay. Actually, are we about to kiss right now? This is it. The digital version of the weekly magazine. My father's deteriorating health and that he's bedridden. The fact that my mother primarily supports us, they even reported that my mother works in a nightclub. Which is not untrue, but was it really necessary for this to, for them to write about all this? Capitalizing on a family's private matters is just cruel. My family's troubles have nothing to do with my skills as a shogi player. That's so mean. My mother was furious when she read the article. She said it'll hurt her career and that she'll never forgive whoever wrote it. My father didn't say anything, he just sat listening to her. But he looked troubled. <sighs> My mother told me that. We'd be able to easily quell these rumors if I were beco to become more famous. So now she's even more insistent on having me do TV and magazine interviews than before. Is that frustrating? Yes. Although I can't express that to my mother, she's so happy for me. Um... I always believed that I, if I worked hard as a shogi player, I'd be able to support us, but I never expected such a destructive article would be written about me and my family. Honestly, nothing good will come from being treated like an idol. People say I'm all looks and no skills. They're annoyed that I'm in the press all the time. Terrible things have been said about me, suggesting I would do anything to become popular. I'm even starting to be shunned in the shogi world. That's why my senior acted that way toward me. Um... The real reason I practice in the, in the church is that no one wants to play with me, Hifumi. My father used to practice with me from his sick bed, but his illness made that impossible. Maybe I should stop playing shogi and just get a job. That way my family won't get hurt again. Is that what you want to do? Huh? No, to be honest, I don't want to quit. I love shogi. <laughs> Yes, you're right. You understand my true feelings. At the end of the day, I love Shogi. I'd never be able to give it up. I was just confused because of that article and how my senior treated me. However, I think I could see my next move, thanks to you. You're helping me a lot. You're helping me realize a lot about myself outside of Shogi. Okay, so she's the star right. arcana. Let's return to the church and play a match. That article has left me somewhat irritated. I'm going to use my secret move, the Eternal Abyss Yagura Gate, and turn the board into hell. <laughs> well, would you care to face me in a match? Ooh, we got more knowledge, cool. Yeah, Akechi would love this place, yeah. Are we gonna see Jing Freaks? Until next time. <laughs> Roche, not that. The star Kana, your mind, third heaven? Wow. Hello, this is Hifumi. Um, Dude, it's Grizzy, thank you so much for the prime sub! I appreciate that, enjoy your emotes, enjoy your sub badge. Thank you for using your prime here. Also, Aaron, hello, welcome in. Thank you so much for accompanying me today, I needed the distraction. Trying to solve this on my own, I felt caught in a vicious cycle, but you helped me find a new path. You might make a fine priest yourself, considering how good a listener you are, I mean. <laughs> no, this is weird. This is weird. Confess your sins, my child? No. You think so? She giggled. Perhaps you're simply open-minded, but whatever the reason, my worries vanish when we talk. You really are a strange individual. I was supposed to be your teacher, but somehow the tables have turned. I'm the one learning from you. I would love to keep learning from you. Well then, if you'll excuse me, I'll see you at the church. Maybe we should have been weird to her because she's also weird. You know? Like, would she like that? Roche, I know, that's what I'm saying. Like, she giggled, but we didn't get the little... little twinkly thing. <sighs> Man... 
she giggled right down that. <laughs> All right. Oh God. When I went to buy a present for my grandchild the other day, they had a Phantom Thieves costume on sale. It spelled the country. It spelled the end of this country if kids start wanting to become more like the Phantom Thieves. You're already in your second year of high school. You should have a clear vision of your future. If you're looking for safety and stability, a civil servant is a good option. Hey, Kuzu. Why don't you try? I bet you all think that civil service is all office work. But the fishermen of Nagaragawa are actually civil servants as well, so tell me which sector they belong to. Yes, the Imperial Household Agency. This is it. Very good. Oh, I'm impressed you knew that. Only the co Cormorant fishermen of Nagaragawa are officially used by the Imperial Household. Those fishermen are granted spots on the Imperial Household's agency's board of ceremonies. That said, you can't break into the industry even if you want to since it's a hereditary occupation. If you want a government job, try for a spot in the diet. Though, some may say that's hereditary too. Hmm. Nice going! Honestly, I'm fed up with politicians these days. Isn't there anyone who seriously wants to improve this country? Oh yeah, they said in the news that the cabinet's approval rating went down again. They're the complete opposite of us. Our popularity and approval have been going through the roof. Sheesh. Um, could you use that poll feature in real life? Yeah, when asked the question, agreed. <gasps> taking care of yourself? Have you been taking care of your body? We can rank up with Makoto. Okay. Okay. Let's go. Where is it? Oh my god. Let's go say hi to Makoto. Yeah. Oh god, guys! <sighs> I don't know what to do about my situation with Hifumi and Makoto. If we threw a crayon now, could we dodge it? Yeah. Yeah, we did last time. <sighs> okay, hi Makoto. Uh, well, actually... Oh, so I spoke with Aiko and she said her boyfriend was okay with the double date idea. She asked me to show her your picture, though. Apparently, um, she thinks you look a little lame. She told me that my boyfriend isn't in the same league as her, Tsukasa. I was gonna disagree, but you are a bit disheveled at times. Hmm. This is a problem. <laughs> oh, what? <sighs> I need to up my charm for this? Oh my god. <laughs> Fine. Fine. What else can we do? <laughs> Hi, VG Derek. Welcome and thanks for the follow. Uh, do not get the feeling of what can we do about anything that Japanese Japanese people feel about politics because they're they've been in oh one party state for decades. Yet yeah, charm to impress my girlfriends. Well, my almost girlfriends. Friend. It's fine. <laughs> also, is it uh, Ali? Welcome and thanks for the follow. I can't do anything with a catchy right now. I can't. It's really sad. We need a makeover date with a catchy. I mean, we went to the bathhouse already. He said we could share clothes sometime. Um. Okay, we're gonna go to Shibuya. Can we go work? I really, really, really need to improve my kindness. What do you want to do? And we need to get Futaba's ranking up. Here. 
Thank you for the money. You did great. Thank you. How are you feeling? Hmm. Please. Let's go. All right. <laughs> Wanna head back? <laughs> oh. Hi. No coincidence. I thought I spotted a familiar face, but I wasn't expecting to see you. How long have you been working here? I was seeking a motif for my still life painting and ended up in the front of this flower shop without realizing it. It may do me good to return to basics and draw a flower. Do you have any recommendations? How about some roses? I see. Hmm, I was thinking of purchasing a lily. But something lustrous like a rose might work too. Now how many to buy? I love him! I love him! Ian! Ian, thank you so much for the 16 months! How are you? Uh, Yeehaw! <laughs> Flower shop boyfriends! Ooh, Jahaya! Okay. Oh my god. You know what else we need to do? I need to talk to Yoshida, but I don't know why I'm like unable to rank up with him. Mishima? Oh my god. Y'all, we are... We are ranking up so much today. This is amazing. <laughs> With what money, Yusuke? That's right, he's freaking broke. Hi, Mishima. <laughs> this is so amazing. The Phantom Thieves fever has run rampant. The fan site's blowing up. So, you did the request I asked you to do. Thanks. Hey, um, there's something I want to talk to you about. It's super important. Do you think you can make some time right now? We should go somewhere quiet if possible. Think? How about Inokashira Park? He's only available- hey. Oh, on Sunday evenings. Okay. I have some great info for you. Um. It's about the next target for the Phantom Thieves. This one's massive. Just tell me already. <laughs> hey, I know you're excited, but you don't need to rush me. Yeah, that's why. That's why I want you to tell me right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm... I don't want to be mean to him. <laughs> okay. This is the guy. He's a handsome young actor who's been rapidly gaining popularity lately. He's great at acting, has solid conversational skills, he's even been in all sorts of commercials. If you manage to change his heart, everyone will have to start paying attention to the Phantom Thieves. He's gotta be doing some shady stuff, I just know it. And no, I'm not saying that out of jealousy. I heard a rumor that a famous idol fell into his clutches. You need to act on behalf of her fans. It's none of our business. So you just want to ignore the wishes of those fans, Kurusu? Come on, this is the evil underbelly of the entertainment industry. It's perfect for the Phantom Thieves. I mean, this would be the best publicity possible for what you guys. You well, pretty good tactic, huh? Aren't I an amazing producer? Just you wait, I'm gonna put the Phantom Thieves on the map. You'll practically be swimming in requests. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Yuki Mishima. That's right. <laughs> I'm the producer for the famous Phantom Thieves. I'm not boring. I'm not a zero. So sad. Hey, take out your phone. All right. I just sent you the actor's data. Why? Don't worry. This request will boost your popularity, guaranteed. After all, I'm the reason you guys have gotten this far, right? Is that right? No, no. I think you mean, yes, that's right. Ah, uh, you just don't know all the stuff I do for you guys. The Phantom Thieves' success is thanks to me, and the Phantom Thieves are changing the world. That means I'm the one who's responsible for those changes. Damn it. That means I'm not a zero. He's really trying to convince himself this. Make sure you check the info I sent you. I'll let you know once I found some more details. 
See you around. <laughs> Bye. I feel bad for him. <laughs> Mishima, stop. <laughs> the Mishima hate Morning. in the chat right now. <laughs> he didn't call us after. He didn't call us after. It's fine. Also, Fief, hello, welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Hi, Ryuji. It's good to see you. Hey, are you keeping up with the comments online? There's a lot of hate for Akumura and a lot of expectations for us. I hope Haru's dad has a change of heart soon. They have high hopes for us. I know, ain't it awesome? This will be a huge uproar again. As usual, it'll be a while before we see some results, but man, I'm so looking forward to this. Mishima taking credit for nothing. Okay, he didn't do nothing hey. though. He made the fan site, which has honestly been really helpful. Right? Has he done anything else? Not really. What are we doing today? All right, we have Maruki. To Yusuke. Yeah, let's go talk to Yusuke. Do you have the Emperor? By the way. Wait. Let's work on our deal. What does that mean? Sean, thank you so much for lurking. If you were a catchy, where would you be right now? Maybe being a little gremlin, trying to work and do his detective stuff. Yeah, we're gonna go with Yusuke. I came to see you. <laughs> you must have a wealth of free time if that is your decision. Oh, I'm undergoing a bit of people watching to gather my thoughts. Would you care to join me? Okay, yeah, let's hang out wow. with him. Let's go somewhere fun. Yes. I would prefer somewhere where somewhere so beautiful it simply tit titillates the imagination. Now, where should we go? Somewhere beautiful. Maybe the shrine again. Yeah. Let us head off. Oh, that's right. He can copy oh. skill cards. I find it hard to believe Harajuku is just outside. The silence near is simply otherworldly. I see. That is why religion has historically tended to be a central motif in the art world. Perhaps artists picked up on something out of the norm. Now then, we should give an offering. Is there anything you want to wish for, Akira? Good grades, a hot girlfriend, boatloads of money. Where the hell is the hot boyfriend option? Um... <laughs> what is thing funny? So what? true. <laughs> hmm? I am somewhat... Actually, I would wish for that as well. However, considering I call myself an artist, I should subsist... I should subsist solely on art. Reliance on a god. Hmm. It sounds sublime, yet is in fact quite ordinary. It is suf... Sophistry disguised as prayer. That unbalance, this festering thing that exists in the depths of people's hearts. Hmm, it may not actually be so bad. That reminds me, Akira. Even a one yen offering is said to bring divine favors, yes? I would offer more for increased monetary luck, but even five yen is tough for me at the moment. <laughs> I'm begging Yusuke to get a job. <laughs> Well, the gods will surely understand the dire situation of my wallet. <laughs> By the way, you can have this, Akira. After all, what goes around comes around. One must spend money in order to gain money. 
he's giving me something? After he just oh. was like, I'm broke. <laughs> Somebody dropped a 10 yen coin on the ground. How lucky. I hope he becomes an extremely successful uh, artist and like gets so much money when he's older. In case you would like to stay apprised of the situation, little has changed with my father so far. I appreciate the consideration. I've yet to truly speak with him, though. As I said before, this is just what happened to Madarame. There's no need to worry. Still, I'm sorry. I know you're all waiting to hear about the mental shutdown culprit. Father is physically weak, so it may take some time. Let's be patient. He's right. We don't need to be worried. In that case, ain't it time to be talking about our next celebration party? Yes? Too soon, too stupid. What? We can talk about that some other time. For now, let's wait patiently. Yes, I'll contact everyone if anything comes up. Okay. Um, Akira has thousands of bucks in his wallet. Yeah, and let's use Yusuke starve. I'm like, can we just can we just give him some money? Can we feed him? Also, by the way, heroes, thank you for the mod love earlier, and Wars, thank you for grabbing your seat. Welcome in. Oh, it's a jazz bar night. Okay. Wait, is it? Wait, it's in Kichi Joji, isn't it? Okay, let me go here. All of your all of your stats will improve. Oh, oh bitch. We gotta do, do it. Do? Yeah, let's invite someone. <gasps> Can we invite a catchy? Yeah. Fuck. Okay, it's fine. Um <laughs> let's invite oh god, do I wanna invite Haru? Maybe we'll invite Haru. <gasps> no, wait, let's invite Futaba. Yeah, let's invite Futaba. Oh. Hmm. I just remember, we finally have like hey. the right kindness with Futaba to do stuff. <gasps> oh, it's you. You came here with Akechi kun before. My name's Muhin. I'm the manager of this jazz club. I'll welcome any friend of the catchy coons here. Just as the sign said, I can't serve alcohol to high schoolers. So, but, or sorry, but you'll have to make do with non-alcoholic drinks. But hey, the non-alcoholic drinks taste just as good. Thanks for coming in. All right. I don't think Futaba would really enjoy jazz, but it's fine. <laughs> Oh, look at us! She's like, what am I doing here? <laughs> no way, this is impossible! I'm super nervous right now. But at the same time, I'm kind of hyped. It's like a dungeon in here. Oh. Somebody's singing! I feel so inspired. Is this how live concerts feel? They're so cute! This drink! What is this flavor? Supreme or ultimate? Whatever it is, it's good. I love them. You know how when you make instant yakisoba, the package says it's done in three minutes, right? But what do you think that three minutes actually means? Do they mean like pour out the hot water after three minutes? Or is that the moment that all the water is supposed to already be gone? I want to eat them at their best. Good questions. I chatted with Futaba for a while. Oh, I gotta go home soon, so Jiro's gonna start worrying. It's not bad spending a day outdoors every now and then. My thanks, Akira. All right. Oh, cool. Okay. All right. Wow, and that's some good increases. Max HP by twenty and max SP by ten. Thanks for today. I don't even think she can use SP though. Okay, I'm glad she enjoyed it. Okay. I'm really glad she enjoyed it. Um, <clears throat> Futaba seems more like a lo-fi beats to study and relax too. Yeah, for sure. 
Yeah, she hasn't battle. She's not gonna be able to use that HP stuff, but it's fine. Um, Nabs, hello, thanks for grabbing your seat. How are you? What do you think will happen to Akuma at food? Shucks. Well, even if the CEO has a change of heart, the company's image is still in ruins. I imagine their stocks plummeted. Do you think Okuma really exploited his employees? Every little rumor goes viral these days. What if it was all just a lie? If so, the real victims here are the employees themselves. Nah, the rumors about Okumura Foods were all well known in the industry. You're overthinking it. Hmm. Um, Katie Crossing, hi, thanks for the follow. Vitaly, she's 100% little sister vibes for me. Yeah. Nabs, how are you? Your answer top actually felt like her and Joker had more chemistry out of Joker. Oh, and girls to his age. Also, one of your favorite characters. Yeah, she's really cute. Cream cheese and strawberry crepe snaps. I'm so jealous. We haven't seen a catchy today. We've seen his name though. And gasps were had. <laughs> so. Hey, did you hear? The sports meet went pretty great. The way they overcame all the odds and made it to the victory stand, it was like something out of a movie. Yeah, they put on a stellar performance this time. They must have been training really hard. It's nice to see more people with smiles on their faces now. Wait, you actually went to watch? Seriously? I get what you mean though. Maybe I'll go and cheer for them too. <laughs> Thieves Den updated? Ooh. Um Hey, hey. Let's see. <gasps> Let's go talk to Futaba. Yes. Actually, okay, wait. Yeah, let's go talk to Futaba. Hi, Reborn Trees. How are you? Thanks for the follow. Where is she? Here she is! Finally! We've done all we can. Now we wait. Oh, that's right. Um, well, I'm sorry about what happened in Akihabara. I really messed up. That police officer, he was a way higher level than me. You do well, Futaba. Yeah, I guess you're right. I mean, I still managed to buy some stuff after that, but that was only because you were there. Anyways, um... can we go up to your room? I want to talk to you some more. Let's go hang out with her. Hi, hey, Katie. What game is this? Never heard of this one? Yeah, this is Persona 5 Royal. <laughs> Goro, a catchy dating simulator? True. <laughs> Oh god, I'm gonna put these down. Goodbye, Pochita. Goodbye, Roger Cat. Akihabara was lots of fun. This is wild, because this was so long ago, going to Akihabara. I think I want to try going somewhere else sometime. It really sounds like Sojira wants me to go back to school. But online classes are Betty for stuttering. Betty better for studying. Oh my god, I can't talk. I wouldn't even have to leave the house. That wouldn't solve anything. Ugh, oh, you're probably right. Just studying by myself is way different from actual school. School. Um, um to be honest, I really do want to go back. Do you think I'll be able to? Want me to help? Really? Of course I do. You'd better not go back on your word. I... I'm gonna do my best. Oh, that's right! Oh, I should make a promise list! Oh, uh, what? My mom used to have me do that all the time. She'd write all my goals for the month, like cleaning the house or running errands for her. Then, when I'd finish one, she'd mark it off with a big stamp. She always used to write comments, too. Those were the best. Oh, and once I finished my goals, she would take a day off work to spend time with me. All right. It's decided then. I'm gonna make a promise list. Time to get my ideas ready. This reminds me of, um, Bunny Girl Senpai, like the last arc in that show. All done! So, these are my promises. 
Go somewhere with lots of people. Getting used to big crowds is key. 2. Go to school. I want to see what the inside of a normal high school looks like. 3. Learn about my generation. I definitely need more info. And 4. Have a normal conversation with a stranger my age. Mm. How's that? Sounds good to me. Settled. I'm not setting a deadline for this, by the way. I want to try and finish all of them someday. You're gonna have to help me, though. I'll work even harder with my navigation in return. Hell yeah. Doesn't sitting like that kill her legs? Honestly, I find it kind of comfortable. <laughs> also, Katie, thanks for doing hi, you new. Um, let me know if it's okay if I just call you Katie. And Fee, thanks for lurking. Jose, thanks for hanging out. Have a great rest of your Monday. Alright, memento scan. Chance to fully map a floor of mementos when entering that floor. Alright. Oh, that's nice. So, um, if I finish all the promises, do you think I could have a reward? I know it's kind of weird to ask, but having a reward waiting at the finish line will totally push me onward. All right. Anyway, I got this. Though, I'm kind of exhausted from making the list, so... tomorrow. I got this tomorrow. <laughs> okay. I'm gonna make like a hedgehog and roll out of here. Hoi, it is I. Thanks for spending time with me today. Taking out the promises brought back memories of when I worked on it with my mom. Hey, if I finish the promise list and, promise list and start going to school, do you think it makes Sojiro happy? I bet it will. Right, right, okay. That's another reason I gotta work at this. I wanted to think of something I could do for Sojiro, but that's all I got for now. But first, I gotta finish the promise list. Doing this alone would be like, omega hard. Like trying to solo a final boss. But now I got you in my party. Hehe, <laughs> I'm counting on you. So yeah, I'm stoked. Let's start Phantom Quest 4, Chapters of the Phantom Thieves. Sure, we got a party of only two, but don't worry about that. Bye for now. She's so cute! Katie is fine. Okay, perfect. Thank you for letting uh, me know. You're back. You've been carrying that broken laptop around for a while. You can't use it until it's fixed, right? We just need something to repair it. I bet Akihabara would have something that'd do the trick. Yuck, you're going. He's in his suit today! <laughs> we have a- uh, we're gonna shut up. Hi. Hi! Hey, Karusakun, good evening! Hey. I have some time before the shoot. If you're not busy, do you want to hang out? What do you want to do? We gotta. <laughs> we gotta, okay. <laughs> he looks so good! Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Our bond's gonna grow stronger soon. Goodbye. Bye. <laughs> His briefcase of gloves, yeah. <laughs> He's so showered. I can't believe y'all think Akechi's greasy. I can't believe it. <laughs> okay, it's Sunday. How many more days do we have left? Well, then. Uh, okay. We're gonna go downstairs. Let's check the TV. Lantern necklace and pumpkin soup. A ghost repellent set. Hey, hey. Um, a holiday set. Oh my god, it's Halloween soon, isn't it? I want this. Okay. I catch you gonna grow up looking like Hojo. Oh, no, that would never happen. I catch you only lets the water run off. Stop. <laughs> okay. Um. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Let's see. Oh, we can rank up with Yusuke. I 
I do think I want to go to Shibuya. Um, and we're going to go to the underground walkway. First, we're going to get some juice. And then maybe we can rank up with Yusuke. Um, he looks so good. Look at him. Okay, let's get some juice. Hi. Mm. I think nice. Sunday's also the day that Yoshida comes out at night. So we need to go talk to him too. Alright, cool. Uh hmm. Hayusuke. By the way. <laughs> I'm still unsatisfied by what happened at the exhibition. I've thought a great deal about it. And well, there is something I would like to try painting. Do you think you would be free to help? Yes. I'm in your debt. Alright, we're going to the park again. Yusuke Thank definitely you. showers. Can't keep hair like that without <laughs> obsessive care. That's true. <laughs> um, do you ever spend the day thinking, I know I need money for something, but can't remember <laughs> what it was? Yeah. Yusuke, yeah, he was on his hands and knees last time being an absolute dramatic boy. All right, thank you for your assistance today. He's sketching at the park while we're on a boat. This is the cutest thing. What are we doing here? Did I not tell you? There is something I wish to draw. As I take up my pencil, you shall take up the oars. <laughs> we will voyage to sea in search of my next motif. Look at all the ducks. They're so cute. Don't get so excited. You'll fall off, you know. Hmm. Perfect. This is it. My previous painting captured only one aspect of the heart, desire. As such, I was unable to arrive at a truly authentic representation. That is why we have come today. I shall paint a second aspect, the burning passion between man and woman. <laughs> Fittingly, our theme today will be the wonders of love. <laughs> you too will have an important role here. Oh, really? While I draw, ensure the boat remains as steady as possible amid these devilish ripples. Ah, this angle. Incredible. <laughs> that bashful side profile. Those moist eyes. Their overflowing passion is wholly evident. They are akin to Adam and Eve, yet in time, all lovers must come to know the pain of separation. Separation is a natural end to any such relationship, but even beyond that, love endures. Precisely. This is the truth of the human heart. It will make the most wonderful painting. It shall be adored by all who gaze upon it, it may even be given top prize in the next exhibition. Wait, now is not the time to be thinking of such trivial matters. Hey. Can you please remain still? <laughs> what? Return to your prior angle. I must capture your profile. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Rejoice. <laughs> For I shall preserve your beautiful love so that all so that all coming generations may bask in its glory. Once I complete this painting, you will become new legends in the art world, a modern Adam and Eve. Yusuke, I'm embarrassed right now. This dude's off his rocker. Come on, let's report him. Hold on a sec. Are you drawing us? What? Are you using us as models? Yes. A man and woman intimately swaying in dignity of dreams, the blush of their cheeks, the bashful looks. Yes, this is the love I was so empathetically searching for. Emphatically searching for. Love? Uh, I guess you could call it that, but it's kind of weird. Are they brother and sister? <laughs> it's familial love. This here's my sister. I told you I didn't want to come here with you. The only ones who do this crap are stupid couples. Oh, what are you saying about me and Yusuke then? But I've always dreamed of coming to Tokyo riding a boat here. Oh, it was supposed to be with my boyfriend, not my brother. How could this be? Familial. So that overflowing passion was just a figment of my imagination. It seems my bias has caused me to overlook the truth of the matter. Love comes in all forms, yeah. Love is a broad, multifaceted beast. This only serves to prove how narrow my perspective can be. I see. Hmm. Romantic love and familial love. The two may be nigh indiscernible depending on one's point of view. Hmm. <laughs> Perhaps the truth of the heart lies in the eye of the beholder. 
Akira, I feel as though I've learned something today. <laughs> He's so ridiculous. Oh my god. Also, hi Revan, thanks for grabbing your seat and thanks for the hydrate. Y'all make sure you're drinking water. All right. We can use art talk. Wait, so only couples ride these things, right? That means those two? Shh, there are people from all walks of life here in this city. <laughs> Ooh, tell me more. We need to come here with the catchy. Let us return home. Well, come, it was about time we return home. Please row us back to shore, Akira. See you. Farewell. He's a legend. He is. Kira, thank you for all your help today. I've certainly come to realize my lack of experience. It would seem I understand nothing of love at all. Though I progress one by one step, there is no doubt I will, face many, I will face many difficulties moving forward. When will I fully understand the heart? Even if I ever do understand it, will I truly be able to draw it? Don't get discouraged. You're right. I have no intention whatsoever of giving up. I will do everything in my power to get past this. Anyhow, today was a significant use of time. Impressive oarsmanship from your end as well. <laughs> I hope I can count on your help next time as well. For now, farewell. Oh my gosh, we're into October now. We're on October... Uh, 3rd? You're back. Almost? We haven't been to our beef bowl shop in a while. All right, UI. Oops. Who's here? Mishima again? I don't really want to talk to you right now, Mishima. Hmm. Can I talk to you again, Yoshida? Everyone. About Yoshida's speech skills, we should make use of them when you negotiate with shadows. You think we can? Well, it's up to you, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Teach you how to give speeches, why? I want to do what you do. Mm. I'd love to help you, though. How shall I teach you? It's time for my speech. Let's talk about this later. Oh. And while our society <laughs> appears to be prosperous, I forgot this is a thing. Many of our young people are quietly suffering. <laughs> also, Booty Warrior, thanks for the follow. And is it Sylvan? Thank you for the follow, Zella. Welcome in. They lack jobs, security, savings. The next generation will lead us into the future. And yet they have no plan for how to arrive there. Yoshida is speaking facts. Watch where you're going, you little shit. You bumped into me, you old goat. <laughs> this isn't good. Oh god, do we want to butt in on this? Let's mediate. Yes, let's. Good citizens, please stop fighting. What is the point of bickering over such a trivial matter? I don't know if we should have done this. Your business. Oh. Yeah, seriously, just shut up. What's with this guy? Now, if you'll please excuse me, I must return to my speech. Together, we can create a bright future for the next generation. Ugh. God. So righteous. That really annoys me. Enough of your arrogance, no good, Tora. What? Huh? As if anyone would actually vote for you. Are you planning to embezzle funds again? Or maybe criticize one of your constituents again? You criminal! You no, criminal. <laughs> oh no. Has he embezzled money? I've gone and done it again. You're a criminal? There are many who would agree with that statement. 
Whenever someone calls me no good Torah, I panic. I went through quite an ordeal 20 years 20 ago. 20 years ago. Let me explain. I used to be a member of the National Diet. I was elected during the rise of the Kuramoto children. We were backed by powerful Diet members. This was about 20 years ago. Hmm. I was very inexperienced back then, both as a politician as well as a human being. That inexperience led me to be involved in a series of major political scandals. People refer to my blunders as no good Torah's three strikes. The first was being caught missing a legislative meeting to take a personal vacation. Then I was accused of embezzling a large sum of oh, money. Oh, he was accused. So maybe he didn't actually do it. Me two strikes. Finally, I called a voter an idiot at an open forum, <laughs> which resulted in scandal and strike. Maybe he deserved being called that. I was out <laughs> and branded a washed up politician. You said you wanted to become a member of the Diet. But do you see the man before you? A questionable background? Accused of embezzlement? However, he has conviction and wants to change the world. Public speaking skills could be useful to the Phantom Thieves, so I'll make a deal with him. Do you really want to receive my guidance? You seem to have conviction. I'm happy to hear that. However, Everyone says I have no chance to get elected. So why come to me? I like your technique. You mean giving speeches? I'm afraid I'm not so great that you'd be able to learn anything. Mm. The most important part about giving a good speech is believing in yourself. Perhaps one day I will believe in myself again. But you sure got me there. You're a strange young man. Very well. If learning how to give a great speech is what you seek, then I'd be happy to instruct you. All In right. Exchange, I would like for you to continue assisting me. Let's get started, shall we? Sure. We've made a deal. Oh my God, 70 hours in and I've made another deal. <laughs> Holy shit. Well, size so strong money, welcome in, and uh, LC, hi, thanks for grabbing your seat. Perry, thank you very much, so much for the posture check. Staging your crimes with calling cards. It's hard to believe that a student could manage this alone. An adult. For example, someone talented enough to move people with words. Perhaps they coached you. Perhaps. Isn't that right? I am, I am thou. Thou, thou art I. <laughs> Hi, Blue thou Jay. Welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Thou. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains That's of gonna captivity. Be. With the birth of the sun oh, persona, the sun persona. I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Cool. All right. Man of the people. All right. Sweet. <laughs> Let's pursue your dream of becoming a member of the Diet. Is oh, that my. my dream? We've been talking for far too long. Let's call it quits for today. All right. You often talk like a six-year-old Japanese man. Who taught you how to do it? I'm sorry. There's something I forgot to mention. It's about my speech. My speech schedules from this point on. Would you be willing to stick around to hear it? Of course. Thank you. Don't worry, it won't take too long. I'll be here giving my speeches every Sunday. You're welcome to drop by and help whenever you got the time. Well then, that's I all I wanted to say. Soon. Now be careful on your way home. All right, bye, Yoshida. It's been months. Oh. Oh. What? Excuse me, but could you please repeat that? Now, nothing's been decided as of yet, oh. but at the rate that things are going, That's right. Yoshizawa-san's honor status could possibly be revoked. Maruki needs to stand up for Kasumi right here. Something so serious should, of course, be brought to the attention of both her parents and yourself. 
I've been told that her results at the latest meet were quite laudable. Mm -hmm. Isn't revoking her status as an honor student a bit of an overreaction on the school's part? Yeah. I understand how you feel, but, well, third place doesn't really cut it in this case. She needs to attain first place results for her exceptional status to be worthwhile. Don't get me wrong here. Uh, personally, I think her results are impressive, but... I suppose the argument could be made that if she's going to represent Shujin and receive special treatment, it's not enough. I literally hate almost all the adults in this game. That's so much pressure. So much pressure Please to put on her. don't shoot the messenger here, okay? Uh, this is necessary to guarantee fairness across the entire student body. It's not as if you've been expelled or the like. Uh, another meet's coming soon. Please try for the results the school wants to see. Sir, putting excessive expectations on Yoshizawa-san will only be to her detriment. Mm-hmm. Oh, that wasn't at all my intention. I just wanted to give her a little encouragement. Dr. Maruki, please continue serving the student body as counselor and providing support to Yoshizawa-san. This meeting was merely meant to express how the entire faculty will be supporting her. That's the reason I had you sit in today, Dr. Maruki. Supporting her. I see. Are they really supporting her, though? At any rate, that's all I wanted to discuss with you today. Please keep in mind, these changes are all hypothetical. Uh, unless Yoshizawa-san doesn't provide better results. She looks like she's gonna cry. Well, uh, I suppose we should wrap up here. Man. Oh. Uh, excuse me. Wait, wait, What's can we talk to you? Yoshizawa? Didn't she seem off to you? No. Oh, it's oh, a charm. It's... Yoshizawa must have dropped it. That's her charm. Shoot, she's gone. Let's return it after school. Okay. We should at least send her a text so she knows where it is. Man. Hmm. Maybe I left it in here. Huh? How did Yoshizawa's son handle the news? She seemed pretty downcast. I think it was quite the shock to her. I truly hope this is what finally drives her to succeed. She needs to push herself beyond third place oh my and bring God. some stronger results. And soon. Vice Principal, I know I've already told you this, but your approach here is going to affect her adversely. Trying to motivate her with harsh words is only going to give her more anxiety. I love Murky. Dr. Murky. We aren't running a charity. If she's going to receive special treatment, she needs to provide adequate results. Praising her until her head swells may be your idea of therapy, but we can't afford to just butter her up forever. We took in those sisters to improve Shujin's standing, but at this rate, we're only going to end up suffering for it. Not only have we lost one of them, but the other one's not doing us any good. Huh. Talk about a waste of effort. A waste? Also, what the heck happened to her sister again? I don't remember if they ever explained it. Millie, hello, welcome in. Oh yeah, for sure. For sure, Haley, I would be crying too. Like, I already want to cry for her. We are running a charity, literally the vice principal, yeah, of a non-profit school. Also, hi, Dondos, welcome back. Streams are going great. Okay. Sure. These people are awful, right? At this point, they've just said she died. Okay. So, uh, pardon me, but there's no denying. First was Mr. Kamishita, now the principal's death. We've got our backs to the wall here. Huh. If this school doesn't bounce back soon, even my own ass will be on the wall. Yeah, I hope it is. That'll be all. Excuse me. I hope you get fired. Oh my god. I just cannot understand. To be honest, I'm fed up with how happy people have been acting. <laughs> I'm so mad that people are happy right now. When people are happy, that makes me fed up. <laughs> Hope they get scathing from Minasan Yelp, yeah. <laughs> 
Stealing hearts? Social reform? Don't give me this Phantom Thieves nonsense. It's all so unscientific. I mean, how could they be targeting Big Bang, Burger, and Okumura Foods? They're criminals. That artificially consummate flavor, in a volume to fill a small universe? Are the Phantom Thieves trying to steal a galaxy of junk food from me? You. That's sad, Karuzakun. Perhaps you think you understand how vast the universe is, full of countless galaxies, but consider this. If we use three watermelons in the sun to visualize a certain matter's size against the universe, what are the melons? Stars, yeah. This is it. <laughs> That's huh, it. I expected as much from you. It's meant to convey the density of stars and the vastness of space. Three bees in the whole of Europe also works. In other words, the universe is essentially empty. There are countless stars in the sky, but the universe is even more vast than that. Even with our own galaxy, the stars are separated by a great distance, despite the sheer volume of them visible. Hmm. Nice going! Interesting. Rio, hello Rio, how are you? Wait, what'd that say? Close, but yet far. You could say the same of our hearts. If you only knew the places we've been. <laughs> okay, are we gonna go find Yoshizawa? Uh, hello? <gasps> I'm sorry. You just now noticed that you tried to reach me. Her phone? Mm -hmm. What the hell? You found my good charm, right? Okay, that's kind of scary. Where are you? Odaiba, in front of the stadium. Where we met before. She's at the stadium? Senpai, sorry, I can't hear you. I don't like that! I guess her signal cut out. I couldn't hear everything, but it seems like she's at the stadium. She seemed to be acting unusually this morning, too. Do you think something happened? Mm -hmm. I'm worried about her. Me too. When we met her there last time, she did mention that she goes there when mm. she's depressed. Well, let's see how she's doing when we drop off her good luck charm. To Odaiba, right? Alright. No connection. We should have gotten this thing replaced already. I'm so useless. Girl! Nothing but cause trouble for Senpai. No! And even Dr. Maruki. I'm supposed to be THE Kasumi Yoshizawa. Come on, I wanna get a parfait. Yeah, yeah, just a sec. I'm looking up a spot right now. It's supposed to be somewhere around here. <laughs> oh, you've gotten us totally lost. I don't recognize any of these places. What's that building even supposed to be, anyway? Uh, I think they're building some kind of convention center. Or was it a research lab? What's it matter, anyway? So it's like on VA? <sighs> kind of sounds like Akechi's voice actor stadium. too. Hmm? Are we here? <gasps> oh my god, we have a cutscene? <sighs> Beginning navigation. Huh? Hey, is that? <gasps> what the? F now, is that a palace? What the hell? <laughs> what the? <gasps> This atmosphere. Is this a palace? But we never activated the nav. Wait. Do you think it was Yoshizawa? Why? Why did she have the nav on her phone? Could Kasumi have the nav? It's a possibility. She wasn't anywhere near us when we slipped into this palace. She can't fight like we do. We have to find her. Fast. I need to change Morgana's outfit. 
First, we had to find a way into that huge thing. Holy shit. Let's go. The area heading down past these gates seems suspicious to me. Let's go, Joker. Okay, wait. I need to go to the bathroom really badly. <laughs> so before we go, wait, can I? No, there's nothing there. It's just question marks. This is someone's palace. Somewhere. Huh. Much to think about. Um, I'm gonna go to the bathroom quick because I really have to go and I don't want to have to take a break when we're like going through whatever this is. I'm very shocked right now. Okay, if you need to go grab some food or grab some drinks, please do. Check your yeehaws if you need to. Check your frugies. Miso checks. Yeah, I'll leave y'all with this theme. I can't wait to listen to it when I get back. Um, yeah, give me like two minutes. One sec. All right, I'm back. I have so many questions and theories. Hi, Chris. What's wild to me is how every persona already has a banger soundtrack, and every time they release the director's cut, uh, Shoji Meguro is like, here's a dozen more thematically appropriate <laughs> bangers to go with. Yeah, do they add new music too it's crazy because i saw on spotify there's like there's a persona 5 album and then there's a persona 5 royal album um also hi may welcome in thanks for grabbing your seat Let's can i do save it. here yeah oh my god we're 70 hours in almost 71 a lot more music actually okay I mean, battle theme is different. Guys, I have a big theory. 
I'm like, I'm scared to share it. <laughs> okay, obviously do not like confirm or deny or like say anything that would make me think this theory is correct. Morgana has a big nose. Yes, that's it. <laughs> Everyone who has a theory at this point in the game usually says the same thing, really. So, Katie, what is that? <laughs> that was Missy. It was your cat. <laughs> yeah, you'll say it's an interesting thought. Don't, don't even react at all. Um. So. We know. We know that, uh... The SIU, whatever they're called, like this government police entity thing, they planned for, to have the Phantom Thieves take down Okumura, right? So that was like their plan all along. I'm like, what if this... This SIU, these cops, the government, they created the metaverse for their own personal gain, right? To like have things go their way politically. And this Phantom Thieves stuff, it was all just a setup. It was all a setup from the beginning. I'm afraid. I'm afraid to. Read chat. So, yeah, those are words. I did speak words. <laughs> Anyways, so I can go here. I can't go that way. Oh, this is so cool. I want to know if this is someone's palace. Chat is safe, <laughs> except from Missy. All right, we're going in. I don't think Yoshizawa is here. Can we get any further in? Mm. The door might be our only option. Let's go check it out. Entrance hall. So this is like, is this really supposed to be the stadium? Whoa. What the? Cognitive science? No, whose palace is this? Why? Why is there all this information about cognitive science? Can I go up here? Oh. This can't be her palace. She looked confused when she was going in here. Um, hi pajamas. Thanks for grabbing your seat. Yeah, stay on guard though. Oh, that's fun. <gasps> Why? How are you here? Her sister? Who's that? Is she a cognitive being? That's her sister. What? Come on. You must. Kasumi. Stop! Stop it! <laughs> Wait, did her sister have a mental breakdown? <gasps> what in the world? 
Things ready to rumble. Accept yourself. Our Lord laments the foolishness birthed from your pain. What are you talking about? I heard uh, the school moved to her exam period. period. It must, must be nice be getting perks like that. that. Where are these voices? Her whole oh, I'm not bothered, bothered routine really pisses, pisses me off sometimes. Whose palace is yeah, this? Is like, 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 whatever, if it's deserved. But do you think she's earned it? I understand how you feel, but, well, the place doesn't really cut it in this case. She needs to attain first place results for her exceptional status to be worth not only having lost one of them, but the other one's not doing us any good. <laughs> Talk about a waste of effort. I've had enough of this. Yoshizawa? You're telling me I'm not cutting it? As if I don't know that better than anyone! Still. I don't care what anyone says about me. I will not tolerate anyone speaking ill of our dream! Is she... Is she gonna... <laughs> oh. It's all in your best interest. <sighs> Filling my life with this pressure. Demanding the results that you want? Yoshizawa? Could she be? And now you're all branding me a failure? Let me remind you who you're talking to. I am. I am. Kasumi Yoshizawa! So adamant. <laughs> Let's go, girl. <laughs> Wait, her eyes. Were they always yellow like that? Towards splendor. You know the rest. Well, if those really are the shoes you've chosen, then we'll dance to the end. Ooh! This has got to be... I don't know if she's gonna like this. Ooh! <gasps> I just got the chills. What? Love this music so much. She's so cool. I'll show you the way to do this. Nothing too reckless, okay? Thank you. Please do. Look at her. Yeah, All right, what do we have? <gasps> less damage. Okay, and physical damage. <sighs> Slade. Evil synthetic organism. I wish I could like ask. Let's do an all-out attack. Oh, it's... It's really so powerful. <laughs> I forgot I have myriad truth. Okay, I'm not gonna use this persona. Okay, I won't use it. Um... Don't rush it. <laughs> it's tough. Yeah, yeah, let's use this. There! I have Izanagi because I couldn't be Okumura, so I took out the DLC bot or the DLC persona. Ouch. Oh. Let's dance. Show them, 
we do a baton pass? We can't. I guess because it's only one. Yeah, it's only one enemy. Persona! Go down! Okay, nice. Let's go. See. I'm like, I'm thinking about what Kasumi's gonna think of this. <sighs> Cause she, she didn't really take a liking to the Phantom Thieves, right? And I feel like now we have to tell her like what all this is. Otherwise, she's gonna be so confused. <sighs> but like, why would she have the nav on her phone? I have so many questions. Hey, are you all right? I can't be weak anymore. <sighs> Whoa. I'm quite impressed, considering <laughs> how you just awakened to your persona and all. Senpai, right? Yeah. I knew it. By the way, why are we dressed like this now? Mm, curious, huh? It's a really long story. Well, of course. This has to be awfully confusing for her. Mm -hmm. Looks like they found us. Time to get out of here quick. We can explain later. Follow my lead. Right. Hmm. Nobody, thank you so much for the follow. Oh, we're back at... Huh? My clothes changed back to normal too. This was your location before you entered the metaverse. We all just came back. Came back? Did we go somewhere? Oh, yeah. Uh, about that. Please, tell me anything you might know about what's going on. I need to know what just happened to me. I know how you feel, but what should we do? Uh, I feel like we have to tell her. We, we don't, I don't see any alternative. Yeah, you're right. Okay, I'll tell you everything from the beginning. Oh, God. Thank you. A metaverse with palaces and personas. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness, Nipular, thank you so much for the three months and using your prime here. Welcome in. Thank you for the resub. Kasumi's your favorite. She's very cool. I just I don't know how she's gonna feel about this. I'm sure it's not easy to wrap your head around all of this in one go. Normally, I wouldn't believe any of that, but after seeing it all for myself... But wow, you're so <laughs> good at Kitty. explaining things, Mr. Kitty. I'll let that last part slide this time. But isn't there something else that should be surprising you? Huh? A cat's talking? <laughs> it took you long enough, and I am not a cat. I am Morgana. Not a cat, just Morgana. I see. Well, since you seem to know a lot more about this than I do, maybe I should call you Morgana Senpai. He would love that. Oh, that's right. Don't you have something for her? Dropped this earlier. You came all this way to return this? Thank you so much. You didn't seem your usual self this morning. Did something happen? Well, I didn't get a chance to tell you yet, but... I got third place in the last meet. Of course I'm not happy about it, but it looks like the school is even more displeased. I was summoned to the guidance office this morning. I was warned that the school might revoke my honors status if I don't so improve my up. results soon. It would be due to my own inability to succeed in gymnastics, so I have to say it's not an unfair consequence, but I also overheard the vice principal talking about how I'm a useless waste of effort. And I dragged Dr. Maruki into this mess, too, since he was with me when I got the news. That's what really got to me. That's a tough break. So I ended up coming here. 
And then all of a sudden, I was in that place we just left. But I'll be just fine now. Um... I'm like, I'm still trying to think about how the heck the nav was on her phone. Or like why it said starting navigation. Like, was there a word that she said maybe that triggered it? Okay, they're, they're building this stadium here. And I feel like that's gonna be a public place, right? So like the government is dealing with it. It's just my theory. So maybe this is like one of the SIU directors palace or something like that. And like, why the heck did she see her sister there? <laughs> I have so many questions. Also, Miso's here. Hi, Miso. Um, I'm not Clyde. Thanks for the follow. And is it Stives? Thank you for the follow as well. I feel like whatever happened in there helped me to get over it. I'm going to realize my dream for sure. She says this every time. Seems like you really are on the up and up now. But then again, how did Yoshizawa end up finding a palace in the first place? This is my question. Sounds like it was pure coincidence based on what she's told us. The nav, perhaps? The, her smartphone, perhaps? The nav. The nav? Well, I suppose that makes the most sense. Hey, do you mind if we take a quick look at your phone? If the nav's on there, we'd be able to tell whose palace that was with the yeah. search history. Sure, it's right. Is it broken? Sorry, this won't do any good. Why's that? The battery's dead. It's been acting up for a while now, so that could have something to do with it. Oh, really? Shouldn't you get that checked out? That's well, on purpose. Like that was I feel like that has after, to be on purpose. So I guess it's no big deal. We couldn't make its ruler our target unless we reached a unanimous decision anyway. Okay, I've been meaning to ask. Are you the Phantom Thieves? Are you two part <laughs> of the Phantom Thieves? Um, well, uh, um, or... You are, aren't you? Mm. <laughs> You're sus of her now? I don't think I'm suspicious of her. Like, I don't think she wants her phone to be broken. And she seemed really, really surprised that she was in there. Cost me the kind of, per kind of person who takes a screenshot on her phone, you see the battery's at 8%. <laughs> <laughs> also, hi, Effort. Thanks for grabbing a seat. Welcome in. <laughs> hmm. You caught us. I knew it. Wait. That means... When we were at the cafe with Akechi san, I basically told the Phantom Thieves mm -hmm. themselves that I don't agree with mm -hmm. what they're doing. Hi, Trav, welcome in. <sighs> I'm really sorry. Don't worry about it. With that out of the way, what's your call? What cost me? That's right. Considering how she did back there, don't you think she'd make a worthy addition to the Phantom Thieves? So, you mean you want me to join the Phantom Thieves? In a nutshell, yeah. You've awakened to your persona, you're aware of the existence of palaces, and from the looks of things, you've got quite the potential. If you're willing to join us, we'd be glad to have you. I don't think I she see. will. Hmm. You don't have to give us an answer right now. I mean, you probably shouldn't make any decisions until you learn more mm. about what it is we're actually doing. Yeah, Thank Haley, you, that's what I'm saying. I'm sorry, I have to turn down your offer. Cool. So we'll head home for now and... Wait. What? <laughs> when I awakened to my... Uh, persona, was it? I also realized something. I can't keep obsessing over my shortcomings in gymnastics like this. Mm -hmm. So that's why I can't join you at the moment. Because you need to focus on your gymnastics. I'm truly sorry to say no after all you've done for me. Um... Oof. That's unfortunate. That's like you, Kasumi. It'll be good training, though. That's like you, Kasumi. Thank you. But I think I'd only 
cause you all more trouble if I were to join up without being totally mm. invested in it. Mm -hmm. Of course, I won't say a word about this to anyone. I'm glad you catch on so quickly. Well, if you ever change your mind about us, just let us know, okay? Thank you, Morgana-senpai. If that ever happens, I'll get in touch right away. Yes. I should extend the same gratitude to you mm. as well, senpai. Thank I you. I swear, one day I will repay you for helping me out in so many ways. Shall we get going? She's so nice. Quite a lot's happened today, but I have a feeling I'll try harder than ever before, starting tomorrow. I'm glad to hear it. <laughs> well, see you later. Okay, bye. So now she knows about the Phantom Thieves. Mm. Great. I didn't expect even Yoshizawa to gain a persona. We ended up saving her, but I don't think she owes I mean. us or anything. That said, she'd definitely be a huge help if she joined us. Hey. Alright, we have another box downstairs. Oh my god. <sighs> oh my god. I have so many questions. I don't think we can Let's go, go downstairs. Bed. Okay. Nice. That's healthy. Can we watch anything? Hey. Oh, we just have to go to bed. Hi, combatant. Welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. You struggle connecting with Kasumi as a character because she's just like gymnastics all the time. I kind of feel yeah. that, Haley. She's always talking about gymnastics. She's always like, I, I have the willpower to get better. And then she always just gets sad after that when she like can't um can't follow through with like whatever she wants to follow through with, you know? No, I don't want any questions answered, I don't think. 70 hours and, and too much to decipher. There's so much to decipher. Also, hi Elder. Most realistic part of this game is that when Kat says it's bedtime, it's bedtime. Look at me so right now. I wish you could see him. He's sitting on my lap. Oh hi! Stretch. Big stretch. You're so cute. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll put you down. <laughs> Me, so they all say hi to you. I love you so much. You're so cute. Okay, you sleep. Yeah, Haley, thank you. All right. Cruz the senpai, I'm sorry for messaging you so late. My phone, my phone's battery finally recharged, so I wanted to thank you while I could. You don't have to be so polite. It's just the decent thing to do. I just wanted to thank you for today. I'm sorry that thanks are all I can offer right now. I'll definitely make it up to you eventually. Don't worry about it. No, please, it's fine. I'll have my phone fixed as soon as possible. Please let Morgana senpai know as well. Anyways, I hope you have a good night. Thank you to whoever pinned that. Oh, Nina, thank you. If only Yoshizawa would join the Phantom Thieves. What a shame. I don't think she would... She would ask. Or she would want to join. Hmm. Yeah, we shouldn't press the matter. So, how are we going to break it to the others? <laughs> oh. Everyone's comments used to be so encouraging, but now they're actually kind of frightening. This is utter chaos. The public dislike of Okumura has grown exponentially as well. How are you holding up, Haru? We've been receiving anonymous threats almost every day now. That's scary. But our security is tight, so it's been okay so far. I believe things will calm down once we finish this, Haru. And what about us? Are we gonna get all popular and shit again? Let us not concern ourselves with that for now. I only pray that things calm down. <sighs> Guess we still have some problems to hash out. We could do more harm than help if we brought it up at this point. Maybe we'll just stay quiet about Yoshizawa for now. And when they find out that we've been hiding information from them, then what? Oh wait, you know what? You know what? Pause. Oh, good morning. I thought that was a catchy hit. Okay. <laughs> Anyways. I'm just thinking back to like the first scene that we saw. We saw Cosme there and she helped us. And 
I remember Futaba. And everyone was like, who is that? Like, we don't know who that is. That's a, a weird reading. So I don't even know if we tell them. <laughs> the reaction in the back. It's fine. It's fine. I thought that was a catchy. <laughs> Oh my god. Yeah, Hannah, I'm so excited for that. I'm so excited for that. The sigh of disappointment. I know. The catchy love, I feel so seen. Listen, I I would die for him. I really would. Okay, hi, Haru. You're not a catchy, but it's fine. Regarding my father, there isn't anything different about him yet. I can't help but think about a lot of things when I'm just waiting. Things like, did it go well? I know. No need to worry. Thanks. Hearing that from you puts my mind at ease. <laughs> I guess I'll relax and look after the flower bed. I haven't been able to for a while. Okay, she's sweet. She's sweet. It's fine. The Phantom Thieves are amazing. Do you think the Phantom Thieves will do the same thing to that CEO as they did to our principal? Come on, they aren't gonna murder him. Besides, I'm pretty sure the principal killed himself. No way, that was a fan of these sending a message. Wake up, people, it's time to atone, or something like that. I'd kill for that kind of power. <sighs> we're being set up. Hey! I already knew that we were gonna be that we were gonna be set up because they're like, Ooh, everything's going to plan. But like, we're really being set up. Okay, everything's fine. <laughs> the way I also clipped it. <laughs> Katie. <laughs> okay, so we have seven days. Hi, on. I mean, I should have known we were being set up since the beginning, because, I mean, the game literally starts with us being interrogated by Sai and the police. And we're like, what? We, we didn't do any of that. Okay, wait, we can examine this? Hmm. People hmm. clearly want us to take care of Okumura. Can't you feel the weight of their expectations? Yeah. <clears> hmm. <throat> so you're so pretty. Should we go with the mementos today? Hmm. I think we're gonna go with the mementos. Uh, how do I get there again? Okay. Let's go to the hideout. Mid mentos, so Everyone's true, here. Cupid. <laughs> okay, uh, let's explore. Man, we're almost at ninety percent. 90% um, trust in the Phantom Thieves. Wait, what'd they say? We have some intel on the possible target. Let's check on that before we head into the mementos. Listen up. Okay, there's an atrocious land speculator. I am in favor. Very well. Um, Listen up. a dangerous assailant. Okay. Man, we have a lot. You know what? Maybe... Hmm, okay, this is a pineapple question. Maybe before I go... I should check... Uh... Oh god, I hope that doesn't change the time. Okay, it doesn't. Um, should I go check out Kichi Joji? Because I think there's some information about targets here. Or is this going to change the time and then I won't be able to go to the mementos today?
It won't change time. Okay. Also, Austin, thanks for the follow. Welcome in. If you have specific places to ID targets. Okay. So I think I'll go here. Yeah, I try to ID a couple of them and then go get a bunch at once. There are some targets you'll only be able to get uh, info on them by getting jobs. Okay, and it takes a couple days. So I know like every time we go to Kichijoji, Morgan is like, oh, there's a target that we can ID here. Um... I just don't know where it's gonna be. Okay, I can't go that way. If you don't spend time with someone or go to a job, you're fine. Okay. Also, you guys, thanks for the hydrate. There's people here. Hi there. Hey, any questions? Uh, anything Actually. I should know? About the fried food shop in the promenade, people say it's tedious to wait in line, and by nighttime it's already sold out. So what are we gonna do if we want one? Well, they say on Sundays they make more than usual. In other words, if you go there on a Sunday night, the story I heard ends there. Okay. How about, about the city? Well, then. There are four different areas. On the promenade, you can find a fried food shop, a stationery store, a secondhand clothing store, and a temple. The ground beef cutlet at the fried food shop is delicious, but you'll have to wait in line. If you take a left at the fried food shop, you'll see Retro Street. Here you can find a selection of chic and sophisticated stores. There's also a jazz club at the end of the alley. Sometimes popular singers will go there, and the liveliness is inevitable. <gasps> Okay, I just, I just need to know. Come again. About who we can ID. Wait, who's this? Oh, this is the the temple guy. Even with eyes closed, you still cannot, s you still see the back of your eyelids. You cannot pretend that you'd not see anything. Please pardon the musings of an old man. What brings you here what today? Do you want to do? Okay, honestly, I might do this. Okay. I think it gives us more SP. So yep. pretty. Ah. I think I was supposed hey. to ID people at night, actually. I think I just remembered that. For the mementos. Hey! Morgana? Please. <laughs> My back itches. <laughs> All right. Max SP is increased by three. Want to head back? All right. Also, JD, thanks so much for hanging out. Oh my God, yes. Get sleep. It's four AM there. Holy cow. Okay, we have Oya, we have EY, and we have Mishima. Okay, I'm gonna go... I'm gonna go to Kichijoji again. Hey, hey! Yeah, okay, Harmony Alley. Where the heck is Harmony Alley? Sunglasses? Hey you, you got a minute? I'm a Chapman collecting rare goods for personal reasons. Rare goods? Yeah, see, I knew that'd get your attention. 
A trader must con constantly fulfill his client's needs regardless of an item being sold out or worth a premium. But the lone man can only do so much. I've been racking my brain over how I'm going to purchase this item. Then you came along, man, and I just knew I could talk to you. What do you say? Will you help a fellow collect goods? I'm not too sure about this. I'll have rewards ready for you, my man. If you get me what I ask for, we'll trade. Sound fair? Just buy the item when you can and bring it to me at any time. Unfortunately, cons consumer demand is always in a constant state of flux. So sometimes an item you bring to me may no longer be needed. Sorry, man. That's just how it is. Mm. Sakai? I mean... As Phantom Thieves, we have to be careful about procuring the item and appraising it, alright? I don't think this guy has any ill intentions, but he's still a bit suspicious. I don't want to get us in trouble. Oh, one thing I need to need to remember, I don't want any trouble. Wouldn't want to burden the clients. That means no stealing. You gotta buy the item through legitimate channels, but alright, my man. Let's discuss our first deal. My request for today is calling postcard. If you can find one, I can trade it for two strawberry defuku. Handing in the item Sakai requested from you will earn you a special item. More requests coming over time. Sakai will not reappear until he has another request for you. Be sure to check now and then to see if he's returned. Huh. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. You literally no never once did that. <laughs> also, hi Max, welcome in. And Roj, thanks for giving Gojo that. Hello, Mr. Gojo. Um, an old man making hey. trouble. Do you think they're talking about the elderly man causing trouble in Kichijoji? Hey, this ain't no place for a youngin' like you. You looking for something around here? The elderly troublemaker. Who boys? Who even kids like you know about him? The old man's out of control. He takes strings from strangers, he starts fights, and when he gets in trouble, he causes a ruckus and tries to mooch money off of people. What's creepy is the more trouble he makes, the wider his smile gets. Got a name? Oh yeah, the old man's always shouting his name over and over. Haiji Ono, right? Yep, that's the name. Okay. Alright, we got the name of our target. But you know, I can't be that hard on him. He's around my dad's age. When he complains about his joints hurting on rainy days, I can't help but still feel sorry for the old man. I wish he'd hang around here, but stayed warm with his family instead. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, let's go. All right, so we ID'd one target. Also, hi, Mac. Welcome in. Thanks for grabbing your seat. <laughs> yeah, noting for your next playthrough, I would have never thought about talking to this guy or like knew that was a thing, honestly. Okay, so... I'm gonna go here. Let's go talk to Oya. I mean, mm, no, not Oya. I meant Shahaya. <laughs> because we need to rank up with her. Ooh, the Empress Garp keeps appearing. Last time I felt you were having trouble with some women, but I sense something different now. Anyway, please be careful. Well then, what would you like to do today? Let's do a verification test. Okay. Yes. Yeah, the Fega with Oya. I accidentally said her name. Absolutely not. Although I would like to rank up with her. Mm, I just it's it takes a lot out of me, you know. Goodbye. All right. That's interesting that she mentioned the Empress. Um, the Empress card. Morning. Cause I think last time someone mentioned an Empress Arcana. And like I don't think we've met the Empress Arcana or Confidant yet. Hi on! The day Haru is going to get sent off is almost here. We took the treasure, so all we have to do is wait. Still, I wish we could do something in the meantime. Why don't we go to Mementos today? Let's do it. Okay. 
Great, I want to do these things when we can. If the president has a change of heart, maybe our reputation will go up and we'll get more requests. Well, let's meet up after school then. See you there. Wait, it gives charm? Okay, I need charm. Okay, quiet down. Hi, Kawakami. I'm changing my lesson for today. Instead of a regular class, we'll be reviewing last week's materials. Hey! Okay, so we can slack off today. What, do what do? should we do? We could get more guts. Okay, let's read Ghost Encounters. <laughs> Not the Kawa Mommy. Hey, hey. <laughs> Thanks, Kawakami. All right, going to the hideout. Hey, we're all here. Uh, let's look at our requests. Listen up. Come on. Uh, oh, and he gets severe joint pain on rainy days. <laughs> sure, let's go. Yes. <sighs> yep. All right. So I guess now we have one, two, three. We have three of them that are ID and that we can go get. So let's go take care of those. Okay, let's go. <laughs> I'm having to say thank you to Kawamami every time. <laughs> oh shit, we have this music again. Oh, wait up! I'm getting a reading! It's coming from below! Ah, yes, we've unlocked more. And now, I think with Futaba's rank up, we can see the full map on each floor, which is nice. A new area has been confirmed in the depths. Updating guidance information. It's gotten even bigger! This happened because we stole another treasure, right? Mm. I feel like it's gonna keep getting bigger and bigger. I don't think Mementos' territorial expansion is caused by us stealing a treasure. I bet it's things like the number of searches for phantom thieves, the ranking of trending words, and the access counter on Mishima's website and stuff. Even now, it's slowly expanding. The more we become the topic of conversation, the more Mementos spreads? Hmm. Maybe it's the other way around. What do you mean? What? We're the ones expanding it. Or perhaps Mementos grants further passage as we become more prevalent in the general public's cognition. Like... getting free admission for being popular? That's rather well put. For real? That's amazing! Actually, you're amazing, Futaba! That's what I'm saying! That Piece of cake. I didn't know it all. Oh, Morgana. What have doing? Oh, don't be like that. You're fine. I'm raring to work. Um, Let's go. Who do I have with me? Let's see. Okay, there's one target on this path. Uh, is it Ugmanda? Hi, thanks for the follow. There's a target in the preceding area? Oh my god, I need to save. I'm so bad with saving at this game. I don't know why. Hmm? Then let's see here. Whoa. What's it like? Oh! So cool. Okay, uh we already got that stamp. The official theme of mementos? Wait, what do you mean? Oh sweet, it's literally right here. Let's go. That scene was meant to play out before. Oh, Akumura's palace. I hadn't been to the mementos in so long. Hey! Alright, that old man must be Ono. Let's stop him before he causes any more trouble for others. Hello, sir. 
<laughs> what the hell? Who the hell are you people? Do you have some problem with me? Hi, Gio, no. Come on. That's the first thing out of his mouth, but it seems like this is the old guy who's making trouble in Kichijoji. Nice. I can tell you're annoyed, even with your masks on. The show is how interested you are in me, Haiji Ono, right? Right? How unsightly. <laughs> He's certainly disturbed. Let's end this, Joker. I'm gonna beat you down. Yes, yes, get mad. Look at me, Haiji Ono. He said, I'm gonna beat you down. Oh! He's cute, though. <laughs> Payback time, kid. Persona! The opponent is strong! We um, can't do anything reckless! Ha! Yeah. Nice? Yeah. Uh. Let's keep it so nice. Ice? So maybe? Nakomata! Maybe we try using fire? Oh, slay! Okay. You're looking cool! Slay! Nice, and we're leveling up. Good. He's only worried about being forgotten. Hell yeah! Ooh. A new move. Okay, medium electric damage to all foes. We gotta grab it. I knew I was wrong. It started with something small. Whenever I do something stupid, my family would worry about me. My son usually treats me like I'm worthless, but he would care for me in those There's times. There's no other way. It felt so good that I started seeking that kind of affection everywhere. I ended up causing so much trouble. Mm. Yeah, An unfortunate hard. consequence of isolation. I've caused so much trouble. How am I supposed to live like this? In any way you can. Seriously? Speak with some brutal honesty, kid. But you're right. I'll start by making up for what I did. That's true. I'm certain that's what your family wishes as well. And from now on, instead of taking it out on others, you should communicate your needs directly to your family. Tell them that you're lonely before it's too late. So true. Let me make it up to you. Alright, nice. A nuisance belt. All right, let's keep exploring. Um, hi, K Fog. I joined stream and I was abusing senior citizen stuff. How are you? Also, hi, Violet. Welcome in. You keep forgetting about Morgana. Oh, and his nose. <laughs> All right, let's get out here. Like how Futaba says the looking cool joker line in reverse. Uh oh, so we don't think it's the same okay. line. I never noticed that actually. Let's do it. Okay, yes, let's save here. Um Alright. I'll send you the results. Go even lower. I'll send you the results. Even lower. Did we get this stamp? Yeah, we did. Okay. Okay, so I think this is a whole new area. Yeah, the path of Kemda, and I believe this is where we left off last time. Okay, let's get in the car. Amethyst. So, Futaba's little. Ooh. There's a treasure chest. Oh, nice. So Futaba is, um, what's it called? Her little power she has to like show us the map and everything. It only works with maps 
for floors that we have already been on. Is that correct? That's a pineapple question, by the way. Why doesn't the Catmobile have the nose? <laughs> I wish it did! I think we can change the... the design of it, though, actually. Um, Ryuji insta-kill ability is low-key amazing. It really is! Oh, 20th anniversary? I changed the... the, like, sticker of the car. New floors? Oh, but it's RNG! Okay. Oh, I see. Okay, there's a platform. We can move on from here. Let me explore more. Is it just me? Or is instant ramen even better on... Space of the game lingo. Oh, for luck. Hi, Plum. Welcome in. How are you? Oh. He's about to say uncooked ramen is better. <laughs> Was he? I wish I heard. I don't think I've ever ate a packet of uncooked ramen. Voiceless lamentation. Man, everything you say sounds like a poem. That's true. Yusuke is a poet, okay? Um... We have not explored this way. Oh, nice! Oh, let's go! Okay, we should definitely go and, um... Go to the ballot room, make some new personas. Push-up count's been getting higher and higher. Could you model for me? I need <laughs> Could someone you who model can maintain for me? a handstand for quite uh, some time. Let's get out here. Is there an easier way to get all the way to the top so I can go to the um the velvet room? Or no? Oh wait, here we go. Wait, I can go to the velvet room from here, right? Or no? <laughs> you can? Okay. Perfect. I'm going. Hello, it's time! Do something. <laughs> Surprise, uh, didn't ask Ryuji to model nude? Pursue rehabilitation with all your A body and soul. Long time one of my favorite. Get ready for this. Okay, 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 okay. Um, we're at level forty-three. I see. This is certainly a powerful persona. Okay, so this is a moon persona. It has the curse ability. Which is really nice. I don't think we have that yet. Choose which skills to inherit. Wait, what is this gonna take? Oh man. I really like this one though. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Choose which skills to inherit. Okay, we're gonna take heavy ice damage. Medium ice damage, wind. Uh. This should be get a respectable, potent power. All right, well, let's well. do it. Yeah, I know the elephant boss and when. Also, let me let me allow that. Oop, here we go. We'll skip that. With the insta kill ability, easy to grind. Ooh, alarms and mementos. I love getting alarms. It's so fun. Oh, sweet. 
You know what? Do it. I don't want that to happen, but it's fine. <laughs> okay, heavy fire damage. Let's take that. Um, Chirizzle, hi, thanks for the follow. Also, Cammy, thank you for the hydrate. Alright, the strain of the guillotine is happening. Oh god. It is neither remarkable nor unremarkable. I don't want to get rid of you, Nekomata. I don't. You've been helping me out so much. <sighs> Why is this always so tough? How did you get, uh, or how did you do the insta-kill thing with Morgana Zakar and you could do it because of your stream? Oh, yeah, so I think it's a Ryuji ability and you press RT while you're in the car. You save Neko in the registry, right? Let me go double check, actually. Go ahead, oh, wait, not that. One. You're stopping? Justine, this one's all you. Is it you register? register a persona. Are you certain? Yeah. Okay. Oh, you can register all of them. You wish to register it to the compendium? Sweet. Can you do that as Joker? Uh, I, I think just when you're driving in the mementos, you should be able to do it. Um. <laughs> Jumi, I know! I know! Now you can get your exact Nekomata back. Okay, sounds good. Finished already? What? No, wait, 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 wait. I still have business here. Now, let us observe. There is an alarm in effect. Prepare for the unexpected. Send it to a world different than this one. Wow. I don't think we can do any of these. You can't handle it. Except for this you one. Really need this. I don't want the Mothman though. This is an alarm fusion. Choose wisely. Okay. Um. Wait, 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 wait. Begin searching. The only one we can do. Tower, okay Red Rider. It is neither remarkable nor unremarkable. I think we have to do this. I'm gonna do this Choose one. Choose which skills to inherit. Okay, we'll take fire. We'll take ice. Lullaby. That and and I guess we'll take the Expect nuke damage the as well. Now let us begin. I'm a bit afraid. I am White Rider. The power to call forth decisive victory is now yours in the form of my mask. Oh. Okay. That did not look bad. I didn't see what level it was at. Okay, wait. Oh, level 8, level 38, okay. So we have fire damage, we have wind damage. Ambient age, we... Why? <laughs> Firewall and stagnant air, alright. 
All right, not bad. Uh, horse looks like a tattoo you have of an alligator. Oh, with eyes all up its back and tail? Yeah, burn boost and big fire damage skills, yeah. <laughs> Wait, the agility? I didn't see it. Thirty-four? Thirty-four for the agility. A biblically accurate horse? Wait, how do we read about them? <laughs> Wait. One of the four horsemen of the apocalypse. He rides a white horse with a bow in hand. A crown was granted to him and he promises victory. Let's read about all these, should we? Long-lived cats are said to become these malevolent cat demons. Their powers vary according to how long they've lived, ranging from shape-shifting to controlling the dead. Justice. This is power. The sixth of the nine orders of angels. It is said that they were the first order to be created. Their duty is to protect human souls from demons. Okay, and Izanagi. A persona turned at Picaro after becoming the trickster's mask. A Japanese god of creation, he begat the sky, ocean, and night, and eight million other gods. Opposes his once wife, the goddess Izanami. Um. Hi, Hawaiian. Welcome in. How are you? A general term for familiars used by Judeo-Christian magicians, they are usually sealed away in bottles, rings, or talismans. They torment the target selected by the conjurer. And we have Inugami, a dog spirit said to possess people in, Jap in Japanese lore. Those possessed are in a state of Inusuki and lose consciousness. On Myoji use Inugami as familiars. And Thoth. Is it Toth or Thoth? <laughs> Egyptian moon god that takes the form of a baboon, he is the one who measures time. He gave Isis the power to resurrect Osiris after he was killed by the evil god Seth. Ipon Datara, a one-eyed, one-legged monster. Oh yeah, he only does have one leg. Uh, said to live deep in the mountains of Kumano, Japan. It's believed to be the degraded blacksmith god Ame no Mehitotsu no Kami. Hmm. You're attached to Nekomana. I'm attached to Agathian. He beat up Kamashitter back in the day. That's funny. Seth is your cat, not an evil god. Okay, Donums, but do you see what your cat does when you're not home? Or when you're sleeping? So maybe you should think about that. <laughs> you're attached to Ame no Uzame? Wait, is that the one I had? Or no? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay. Uh, Hua Po? A spirit of Chinese folklore who dwells in trees once used for hangings. She is smaller than a human and cannot speak, but her voice is said to be as clear and as beautiful as a bird's song. Alright, and now we have Mokoi. Evil spirits of Mergen lore. Believed to be reborn shadows, they kidnap and eat children and strike down any sorcerer who uses black magic. Sure. Okay. Um. Let's go down here. Yes. Oh my god, it's already almost three o'clock. PM. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna keep going. Um, I want to get this. I think we have two more targets left. Time really is flying, is though. Time is flying. I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> this game, it has me in a chokehold. It does. You suggested a 12-hour event <laughs> stream earlier. Oh lord. I genuinely feel like I should do a 12 hour stream sometime though. With just Persona. Uh, is it Maki Mama? Hello, thank you so much for the follow. Treasure chest spotted. Ooh, we have two treasure chests. Alright, we have more sooty armor. An alert capsule. Oh, I can't go that way. 
this green like light over here they are quite easy to move in. it kind of makes it hard to see <sighs> um oh adam no it's not a 12 hour stream today maybe eventually eventually we'll do one i feel like i have to prepare for it though you know um Okay, we can go in here. Sweet. We can take off our twin. Oh, Tears of the Kingdom come out. Yes. I can't wait for that. That's somewhat like four months. We're getting closer and closer. Um. <clears throat> Max, you want to finish? Uh, Persona 5 Royal at the same time you don't. Oh, your says as well, yeah! How far have you gotten, Max? lot of hanged personas right now so let's release that one i have two magicians too <gasps> oh good i still have necromata on the beginning. Oh my god, Max, you got me so far. I cuz I think the last time that I um asked you about that, I think you were like behind where I was. So you've gotten very far, Max. That's awesome. Kira hi. I'm free on Tuesday. Why yeah, like Ikechi if you're listening you to this. Online. I don't know. Just let I me know. I was hesitant to shop online, but eventually <laughs> I got used to it. Okay, so there's our weight down. We can get another stamp here. Petrol, hello! It's great to see you! How are you? Um, when I was in middle school, a bunch of your friends called in sick uh, to school when Modern Warfare 2 came out. <laughs> Tears of the Kingdom is your Modern Warfare 2! I love it! Can you believe it though? Okay, but what if it doesn't live up to the hype? What if it sucks? <laughs> I'm nervous. We're only in the third area. <gasps> Hi, Jose. I'm I forgot what he up says some again. Chests. What's his motto? Manders, hello. I am still streaming. I didn't even realize I was like five hours into stream. Almost five hours into stream. Till like ten minutes ago. Oh, he says good job. Good job. Oh my gosh, so many chests here. Good thing we have lock picks. Um, there's no way it can't be. They could just release Breath of the Wild again uh, with a two on it. <laughs> and I'd be good. Honestly, I kind of agree with that. Uh, if you're a little worried about that, yeah, but the trailer had you hyped. I'm excited for all like the the air stuff and the flying that we'll be able to do. Don't put these weird sound effects to my elegant cruising. <laughs> Sweet, we found the train platform. All right, I would like to go back and say hi to Jose. We'll see if we can buy anything Engine's from him. Up and ready to go. I don't know. What ex <gasps> nice. Ooh. Yeah. 
Oh, cool. Wait. Oh. Wow. Um, I was like, I'm done teaching for the day. Wonder who's streaming. Oh, Lana? <laughs> Manders, how was your, um, how was your teaching day? I hope it went well. Oh. Doing good? Good job, mister. Oh. oh, that's right. A new area of mementos opened up, so I went around and gathered more stuff to trade. Hopefully I got something you like, mister. Um... Oh, yes! Okay, we need more of these. Let's get a stamina kit. I can only buy one right now. Um... I love this song. So good. Okay. Thank you, Jose. Did you watch Bungo Stray Dogs? I've actually only seen like the first couple episodes of season one. So bumpy. Oops, but I know that season soda. four just came out you, recently, you right? All over my pants. I've been stained. Oh, this way. Joker! Did anyone oh. watch the new season? Did that already come out or is that coming out next week? Uh, also, Angie, hello, welcome in. How are you, Angie? And Max, good luck with work today. I appreciate it. Subtex, hello. <laughs> Burning your eyes, no problem. We're kind of just doing some grindy stuff right now. Nothing really to do with the, the plot and stuff. But if you're worried about that, I completely understand. I hope your day is going well. Hey. And Joe, hello, welcome in. Uh, all right, where do we have to go? No, oh, we have to go this way. Wait, we can break this wall. Oh, look, a treasure. Sweet. Yes, you love this screen and vibe so much. Yeah, the one with Jose. I remember the first time I saw that, I was like, what the hell? Why is this game so cool? All right, we got another stamp. Did that say four out of 20 for the path of Keitel? This is gonna be a long Cousin area. Results. Cat just walked in, but he doesn't close the door behind him. Oh no. Very right, nice. Another one? Oh shit. Okay, I can't go that way. We gotta do another fusion. Um, just got a meeting. You're stressing over that one. Well, nice. We reached the platform. Oh good my god! Job. I'm glad that the meeting went good. Watching humans makes me think about a lot of. Okay, so there are chests over here. This will give us another stamp. I don't really remember what these stamps do. Stamp points? If Can anyone wants to shows? remind me of that, let it's me know. Me what do the stamps do Just again? Beat the crap out of them if they show up in your dreams. Um, music and Starfield is slowly drifting. Yeah, the Belt of the Stars is so chef's kiss. It really is. I can exchange the stamps for bonus XP. Oh, monies and items and mementos. Okay, okay. I see. 
Um, have you played any more Final Fantasy XIV on the side? I did start. I did start subtext, but it's been so long since I played. I actually wanted to download it on my PlayStation so I can like play on the couch and everything. It's a lot of years to get more huh? XP. Okay. Then <gasps> Finally, the target's in this area. Oh, literally right here. Huh? Then. Okay, sweet. Hello, sir. There it is, Naguri's shadow. He's got a crazy look in his eyes. He's been known to attack indiscriminately. I suppose he really has lost his sanity. If we don't make him have a change of heart, I won't feel safe walking around in public. Okay, let's go. We have to do this. Get over here. Sorry. Hey, are you the Phantom Thieves? You came to see me? Wow, I guess I must be famous. Oh jeez, he's the annoying type. <laughs> So, uh, can I help you? You didn't come to pick a fight with me, did you? That can't be. Stop playing dumb, you crazy criminal. I'm doing the world a service. We've got an overpopulation problem with too many old people. My guy. My guy, are you like... I forgot what his story was, but... Oh my lord. Think of this as my own personal brand of justice. Anyways, it doesn't involve you punks. Too many old people, yeah. Oh, he's cool though. Let's take him down, Joker. Bloody has a wide stance, Kira. I know. His legs. Come. Heavy fire damage. Let's try it out. Did you guys see how much? How much, what's it called? Health that took off of him? <laughs> Wait, this off. Wow. This is taking a lot of health off of him. Nice, Joker. Just at the last second. Uh, <laughs> God damn. Persona! Persona! Uh... Let's do heavy wind damage. God damn. Uh-oh. Whoopsies. Oh, is he shocked? It would be really cool if we could fight with Yoshizawa. Not gonna lie. I'll take the floor. Um, Nekomana Loki ain't got nothing on White Rider. Persona. Honestly, are you kind of right? <laughs> you kind of right. Uh oh. That Persona. didn't hurt at all. <laughs> Shall we? Um, started at 14 and 20, 21 dropped it completely, only committed to playing it. Yeah, all last year. How far have you gotten? Have you finished, like, all the storylines and stuff that have come out? Done. Turn yourself in. Alright, we got another one done. Um, High Storm Talon. Just installed 14 on the gaming PC in the other room. Kid left it. Oh, when we move back to Minnesota, you can be ready for tomorrow's patch. Wait, are they like releasing a new yeah. part of the plot tomorrow? Or is it just a patch? Okay, let's leave. the wrong button on this controller. 
Um, oh, Joker? nice. Let's open. Hi, Charlie. <laughs> He's only free on Wednesdays. Maybe he would make an exception for Joker, you know? I'm upset. We didn't really see him today, but that's fine. There's a treasure chest. We heard his name. That's all that matters. It's cramped in here, but that's what makes it good. Um... Enjoyment of small. Okay, sweet. We can don't go down. Let me see what's over here first. I see it. There's a uh, not a full expansion, but oh, new story content. Okay. I think it's really amazing that the game developers are still Panther, like giving could, um, so much love go on an evening to that game. Because how long has it been out? Oh, that sounds nice. Do you take Mona on walks too, Joker? Oh my god. Okay, here we go. Um, devastated by the lack of a catchy. Chris, me too. <laughs> Perhaps on Wednesday. Perhaps on Wednesday we'll see more of him. A catchy thing isn't enough. Okay, sweet. So we can quick travel here. Let's save. Uh, since we can quick travel here... I think I'm gonna go to the Velvet Room. Hello? Do you need something? Morgana just got absolutely destroyed. Wait, what happened? Did I miss something? <laughs> I'll see. Hi, thanks for the stretch. Oh gosh. All right. Hi, Igor. As a result of your daily efforts, the number of personas in the inmate registry has risen. Our master is pleased with your rehabilitation and has yet again bestowed a special privilege. We're giving you a discount on something from the inmate registry. You better be thankful. Okay, sweet. Pursue rehabilitation with all your body and soul. Um, you wish to view the compendium. So now it's cheaper. Take a look. To buy them? Is that what they mean? Registration. Do you wish to register it to the compendium? Um 14's coming up on its 10-year anniversary! That's wild! Yeah, is that his peak of popularity? Finished already? What? Wait, 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 wait. I still have business here. Mona asked Anna if she'd like to go on a nighttime stroll sometime. Anna asked her if she often took Mona on walks. Now, let us observe. I didn't know you took Mona for walks. That's so funny. There is an alarm. One of my favorite dudes. Get ready for this. <laughs> All right. So... Wait, what do we have? Fusion. We have two moon. Two moon personas. I truly hate this guy, but it'll make us a tower Choose persona. Skills to inherit. Ooh, we get a bonus. Oh, almighty damage? Oh shit. Wait. Okay. Okay. Choose which skills to inherit. Almighty damage. Let's take that. Evil touch. I mean, foul breath would be nice. Ice boost, yeah. I cannot expect any new power. Be sure. reborn. Um. Cheaper to summon. Open the compendium now? Okay. 
Looking through Xbox Game Pass, saw the Persona 3 and Persona 4. Yeah, we'll be coming on June, January 18th. I'm excited. Yeah. Uh-oh. What's it gonna change to? Are we gonna permit it? Ooh! Okay. Okay, cool. So now we have to do this again. Oh, look at all these. That's a pretty strong one. <gasps> oh, I don't know if I like that. It is neither remarkable <sighs> nor unremarkable. Let's do it. Choose which skills to inherit. Okay, we definitely want heavy, <gasps> heavy almighty damage to all foes. Holy shit. Okay, we're gonna take that one. Um, let's take the heavy fire damage. Nuke damage. And let's take evil this touch. Some small power. <laughs> I see. Oh god, I'm afraid for what's gonna happen though. Give me something good, please. For for tuna. Your luck's gonna come, it will, it will. Anyway, here's your Mask of Fortune. That's a sleigh. Okay, what do we get though? Fusing. Oh, fusing with other personas. You can cover up their weakness. I see. I see what you mean. Okay. All right. Good fusion material. Yeah. Looks promising, though, sir. She looks so cool. Okay. Wait. Let me save again. Let's do it. I want to finish this day, and I also want to. Make sure that we can, um, get this last target. Subtext, thank you so much for hanging out. I appreciate it. Hope you have a great rest of your Monday. Also, hi, happy, sad. Yeah, we're still on. So you slept? Wait, did you take a nap or did you, like, actually go to sleep? up here Joker there's a chest There's a chest Um have you saved yet yeah, Elder I did Uh <laughs> when I just travel down here I'm going to knock him out oh. I don't know why in this game I'm like I'm missing saving so much like sometimes I won't save for at least an hour I don't know why. The platform. Uh, will only do a 12 hour? I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know. Maybe when we get further to the or closer to the end of the game. Good job, human. Okay, nothing down there. 
We can definitely get more SP items, which is good. Jose. Mister. Doing good? Okay. Okay. We got two of those now, which is good. And we got a snuff sn snuff soul. Yo, there's an escalator going down over there. Yeah, stamps too. Are you gonna be playing God of War Wednesday? Adam, I think we're gonna be playing Persona 5 again. I'm just like, I'm obsessed with this game right now. And the thought of playing any other game, I'm like, mm, no. <laughs> so I apologize. If any of you are waiting for God of War, I just, I wanna like, play what I wanna play, you know? There's a treasure chest. Um, you can't interrupt. Yeah, you can't interrupt the Akechi brain rod. Exactly. Who needs drugs? <laughs> Persona. Exactly. All right, a chest. <laughs> um, yeah, I can't grow on streaming either. Both the games are great. I'm just, I'm in a, in a phase right now. Definitely. Holly, hi, I am still here. Yeah. How are you, Holly? I want a new PC. <laughs> Futaba's just like me. I want a new PC too. <laughs> Actually, no, I don't think I need a new PC. I just need a new graphics card. It's mine is getting kind of slow, the to be quite honest. Futaba gets me, <laughs> yeah. Um, a catchy first priority always, for sure. If God of War <laughs> had an catchy mod, can you imagine? Ooh, Jochi Shadow found you. Indeed. Judging from the smirk on his face, it looks like he's scheming something awful. I heard he was threatening the old couple, trying to kick them out of their own movie theater. Yo, what's with people threatening old folks nowadays in this game? Like, literally every single one of our targets in the mementos today had to do with old people. The first one was an old man. The second one was, said there were too many old people in the world. <laughs> now this one. <laughs> ah, so you're the Phantom Thieves. I'm not sure what you'd want with me, though. It seems like you're trying to use force to get people to leave their property. Land development is important. Getting rid of stubborn people in my way is part of the job. I'm not playing around like you kids are doing. We're quite serious. We can't let those who cause problems for others go unpunished. That includes people like you who use bullying tactics to get what they want. You're just pissy smelling kids acting big. You should have stopped playing hero back in preschool. <laughs> okay, landlord. Um... Persona. Oh, that's right. <laughs> Do you have any skills with me? Um. Let's try this out. Okay. Okay. Now or never, right? Graphics card can get slow, so. I don't think they can necessarily get slow. But for me, like when I'm video editing sometimes, I think my graphics card could be better gonna knock you out. to like make editing quicker and more you smooth. Sure Does that make sense? All out attack. Mm, let's try this. Ooh, he's shocked, okay. Uh, I forgot what can do technicals with shocks. Oh, there we go, cool. Let's go. Take this! 
More RAM too, yeah. Hi Derek, welcome me. Also Luna, thanks for grabbing your seat. When you edit in Premiere, it's fine, but uh, you open After Effects and your computer is like a PowerPoint presentation. <laughs> it's rough, isn't it? Showtime! This is one of my favorites. Allow me. Oh yeah! A touch of red. Bon appetit! Oh man, it's just what I want! <laughs> Get out of my face! Can't you want this? They're perfect. Yes! They're perfect! <laughs> Alright. New skill! New skill! Makara Khan? Wait, Makara Khan. A barrier that reflects magical attacks for one ally one time. Ugh. I don't think I want that. I don't want that. But if they don't give up the land, I'm gonna get fired. Please, isn't there some way I can have that movie theater? Give it up. Yeah, no one to give up. Or, I'm sorry, I'll give up, so please forgive me. I hope you'll consider the feelings of those who get things taken from them from now on. Uh, I'm sorry. I got it. I'll be honest with my superiors. I'll tell them that no one has any interest in leaving Yongin. Not just Yongin. You better make up for the awful things you've done elsewhere, too. Period. Yeah. Scene look like a whole other game, right, Astro? Right? All right. There's another one? Wait. I guess we'll open this up. It opened. Okay, we've reached a new area. Um... I want to go to a higher area. Uh, hi Patrick Coon. Graphics card do explore over time mostly because of the dust which reduces- Oh, the cooling capacity. Okay, okay. Interesting. Right now I think I have a... 1660 Super. Yeah, a 1660 Super. Okay, let's leave. Oh, did you change your mind? Uh, also Rico, thanks for the follow, and Patrick thank you as well. Gotta blow into the PCIe card expansion slot just like the old days. <laughs> Got my coat of my favorite outfit. It looks like a boxer in that one. I do uh, love that outfit of hers. <gasps> Mishima! We got a new post about the old man who was stirring up trouble in Kichijoji. Sounds like he and his son went around apologizing to everyone in Harmony Alley. It was like he was a totally different person, begging them on his knees for forgiveness and all. I'm glad it worked out. Yeah, the people in town are probably thinking the same thing. Great job. Hmm. Hmm. All this stuff about family had me worried about Yusuke, but it looks like things worked out okay. I'm kind of happy too. Any changes, Haru? Nothing, unfortunately. Father is still indisposed. How are things with you, Haru? Has anything happened with the media? I hope they haven't been horrible to you. Thank you. They will surely say a great deal about my father, but I am determined to push through it. Society doesn't care what may be going on as long as it's enough to kill their perpetual boredom. They don't even consider how their words may hurt others. They think caring about people is someone else's job. It makes me want to puke. There's nothing we can do about that though, and everything they say about father is true. But it's important to remember there was someone else in the shadows behind the shutdowns. Until we bring their crimes to light, this won't enter. This won't end. We'll find the true culprit for sure. Not much longer. Yeah, Haru's father will definitely mention the culprit. That's probably why they took his shadow out. Because he was gonna mention everything. Because he knows too much. 
Okay, okay, I get it now. <laughs> Either way, we'll need to wait for Haru's father to recover. We'll have plenty of time to ask him about it then. The one behind the mental shutdowns. It has to be someone dangerous. Now that we're getting closer to the truth, we need to be ready for absolutely anything. I'm a bit of a rain, you know? I'm just a bit scared. What's up, Sojiro? Now listen up. Half a year to go. Just play nice like you've been so far, right? <laughs> half a year? Have we already been, like, playing this for half a year in-game? Oh, boy. Okay, let me save here. We're 72 hours in. How are we 72 hours into this game? Also, I'm gonna have another save slot, actually. Okay. Man. Eric, hi, welcome back. I'm gonna end stream now. 72 hours in the game, only halfway there. Stop. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> halfway then? I think we have to be more than halfway, right? Okay, everyone. Thank y'all for hanging out today. It was a long stream. I didn't even realize it was gonna be this long. Um, but if y'all want to stick around for a raid, I'd really, really appreciate it. We're gonna go send on some love to someone else who's live. Um, let me see who we could go raid. I'm gonna be live again on Wednesday. And actually, on Wednesday and Thursday, I'm gonna be doing some closet cosplays of... A singular persona character. So, I can't wait for y'all to see who it is. But, I think I know who we're gonna go raid. We're gonna go raid... Emmy, who is currently playing Final Fantasy VII Remake for the first time, and I'm so freaking excited. Um, but thank you all so much for hanging out. I really, really appreciate it. Let me move back over here. Today was a fun stream. Did lots of ranking up, uh, did lots of mementos, and we're 72 hours in? I think next stream we'll finally be able to see what happens to, um, what's his face? Yeah, Okumura. So yeah, uh, let me get this right started. Thank y'all so much for uh, the chat today, for the subs, for the bits. Um, thank you to my mods for being amazing. Oops, not song. <laughs> there we go. I appreciate y'all so much. Feel free to copy the raid message paste into Emmy's chat when we get over there. Let me copy it myself and say goodbye to everyone. Um, bees, thank you for hanging out. Yang, you hi, pajamas, Macy, Skamunculus, Skywalker, Angie, Katie, commonly, uh, happy sad, kitty cat, Amari, Sammy, and Wen, Violet, Nabs, Gats, Katie, uh, Astral, Durek, Hano, Loran, Haley, D Noed. And who's lurking, I appreciate ya. Uh... And uh, I think- I think I said it bye to everyone. <laughs> Love this rap, me too. Eluna, thank you for hanging out. <laughs> bye, Donims. Thank you so much for um, your help today. And y'all, take care. Have a great start to your week. Go say hi to Emmy for me. And I'll see you on Wednesday for some more Persona, okay? Bye, everyone. Bye, 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 bye.